Hello, it's me. What's up? What's up? Oh, I really do got to move that mic arm. It squeaks a lot because I think I just have it too much at its strain. I don't know. I got pretty far away, mostly so it can reach the other desk, but I should probably move it. Regardless, what's good? I'm up. Took a nap today, which I haven't done in a while prior to stream. So we'll see how that does me. <laughs> I have a little bit of coffee and uh, I'm big chilling to play some Tekken. I got uh, a new controller, which is primary, primarily one of the reasons I want to, you know, check it out more. But I got a Hot 42. Uh, I forget whether this one is the, like, G or S. Because they're both pretty similar. I just forget which uh, letter it is. But it's 16 buttons. I was a little apprehensive about getting it at first. Because all of the buttons are 30 millimeter in distance. Which obviously affects how close the buttons can be together. Because the size is 30 millimeters. And I felt like I would have preferred 24 just because I have smaller hands. But, yeah, over the weekend, I spent like maybe two, three hours just kind of hitting it up in practice mode, trying it out. And it felt nice. I did find myself so often, I'm like doing forward inputs and I need to do left and I'm not moving all the way over to left. I kept hitting down. I, I was doing it so often because I was feeling out some other characters just to see like, hey, you know, with an actual controller, because before I was playing on my keyboard and that gave me a lot of wrist pain because I'm rested on the desk and playing like this, right? So it's too much of a like elevation. That was mostly the issue. But part of the reasons I need to like pump up my chair, I think, so I can play on top, very piano like, which would be cool. Um, but yeah, I was just trying out other characters, seeing it was like, and I was playing some Lily, um, which is great character. She has her do glides where you hold forward after certain moves kind of reminiscent to how we were playing leo uh, i just forget what the name of leo's stances are but you would do glide and then have a bunch of different abilities if you touch reina at all it's very similar to that and i was able to actually do a lot more now it's been a few days and a fresh day not to mention but i wouldn't mind like labbing it up and then maybe heading into ranked and seeing what we can do with certain characters. Because I am not sure. I do also have it on a color scheme that matches Guilty Year. Which is uh, notable and nice. Mostly Guilty Year because I had my keyboard colored to that because that was probably Guilty Gear Strive was probably the first game that I was like actually trying to learn how to do stuff. And so my keyboard inputs were colored to that. Tekken doesn't really need it. You just do one, two, three, four. It's mostly for reading notations when people are like forward P pink punch and you're like, fuck, which one is that? But I don't know. It's nice to have something that matches. I say we uh, head in and check it out. Wow. There we go. Yeah, I kind of want to see what we got. No, I don't want to remove it from favorites. Uh, I will say one thing that really trips me up, only because of myself. See if we can see it. No, okay, it kind of knocks out. So these are the main four buttons. It doesn't matter, right? Colors. But like this and this. 
This one's right trigger, and then it's left trigger. We're gonna down with Tekken. You got Tekken, Wamey? Hmm? Thank you for the 22 months, though. It just, uh, it gets me that mentally the right button comes first and then the left button. I would think left than right, but I don't know. It probably has more to do with adaptations through arcade mode um, than it does anything else. No, you don't. It's a shame. I see you on um, Strive. I wish I was better at that game because I'm, I'm absolutely not. All right. Yeah, every time I see you on Strive, I'm like already doing something else or something. So let me see. Let me see if I can show. Whoa. Did you see that kind of load a little weird? Was there a new update? You want to try Tekken? Because you had the older ones? And yeah, it might be. Get ready for the next battle. If there was any Tekken to try, I do actually genuinely think it would be this one. I'll um I'll give some reasons real quick, which will have me get out of this menu in a moment. But one thing I do want to show is the move list for one. There's a move list, okay? Do you hear that wooden sound? That is the inputs. Every single move has this clicking wooden sound to determine how fast you need to put in the inputs. So even though this is a one, two, three hit, the input itself needs to be... Do, do, do. It needs to be a fast input. So Tekken is a bit of, in my opinion, as somebody who is like newer to fighting games and trying, Guilty Gear and Street Fighter were asking a lot more of me from execution. I think Tekken is easier in execution, in terms of combos. I think it's more of a knowledge game. I think it comes down to more like, not only do I need to know what my game plan is, I need to know what my opponent's game plan is, and all of the moves they have. And when I say all of the moves, this is where Tekken comes into being a legacy game. And it's an issue that I'm running into because I haven't played it a lot, okay? Heat is a new system. We're gonna ignore that. Heat right there, heat moves right here. Rage is your special cutscene, okay? It's your super. Just waiting for it to happen. Cool, awesome. From this point on, everything here is a normal move. I want you to pay attention to the scroll bar on the right side of your screen. There's like 160 moves on average per person. Do you need to know all of them? No, but that's where characters that have been in the game for a long time can really win out. Combo challenges, I was trying a few. The one that I was actually able to kind of pull off, which surprised me, was this one. So you can see an example. No, no, no. Actually, it was, it was a while rising. It was this, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, I just didn't do it in the combo trial. So you can see it being done there. Then here I am in my training. So a lot of a lot of Tekken though, straight up is just like directional moves. Like here's my punch attack. I'm just pressing the one button here. I'll turn on command history too. Uh, let's see if I can get this right. Cause I'm using a new controller. Yeah, you can see I'm just pressing the same button. 
forward, back, down. But there's also the difference between down and then when you're crouching. And this is where we lead into what the fuck is that above me that says while rising? While coming from crouch to standing, while rising up, I have different moves. And one of them is a launcher. Let's see if I can remember this. So, like, if you're crouch blocking, you can kind of come out of crouch and do the move. So you got to get the timing right on it. Okay. Oh, my God. You step away for one day and suddenly I can't do this back to back to back to back to back. <laughs> Oh, right. I have to do this forward input while I'm... while the hit lands. It's when that kick lands that I have to press forward and hold it. Let me see. Yeah, I do have to warm up the fingers. And it is a brand new controller that I'm using, which I am trying to get used to. So, we're dealing with that. I mean, it's notably interesting, but... You know, I did it for Strive Colors. Well, I didn't get it for Strive Colors, but I changed it for Strive Colors, so that's cool for me. But I'm going from keyboard to it and trying that out. Let me see. I thought it was when the hit lands. Oh, yeah, press and then hold. Okay, cool. Weird. There we go. And then I press one, two, three, or is it two? There's two and then hold and that little move in I'm doing. It's Hitbox is technically a brand name, so it's a hot 42. Um, I would highly recommend one of these because they're new. So hot is a Chinese brand, so you must buy it through a Amazon reseller or AliExpress. I did AliExpress because I've never bought on AliExpress and they had a like first time bonus where I was able to get this, no joke, for $50. This is the smallest one. I play on my desk and not really my lap, so it doesn't bother me if there's a larger one, but there is and they're like 70 bucks. Hitbox as a brand is like $200 and I'm not exaggerating because they're very niche products. So if you want it, really nice i'd recommend it all right let me uh let me show something real quick so we have punishment training granted this is on the character that i have selected nina this is the nina that i am i'm fighting against i could go and select a different character but if i'm struggling with nina I could turn on and off any of the moves here that are available punishes. I could even go to hard. Okay, so she's raging, right? It's going to pop up and tell me like, yo, with Lily, we actually recommend that you punish the person back with this technique. So it wants me to do forward two and, and then three. And so I need to learn... What's the timing on that? Which for tech and it's fast. And so an easy way to just play the game and kind of learn, oh, these are good punishes. 
So it's a while rising because that hit puts me in crouch. Which I'm not sure how fast I should be hitting this. That's weird. Oh, right. I need to not get hit. I'm sorry. I forgot that punishes were like block it. This is the one thing about Tekken that I'm really bad at is how fast you need to be pressing uh, the punishes. I'm like, I'm really not that good at it. So let me show the other thing because I think this is part of the game that actually makes it the best. The actual speed of the inputs is the thing that I am just absolutely bad at. Let us look at a replay. of mine let's see i don't remember i want to get one it's a bit oh it doesn't show whether or not you won or lost that's a shame just trying to remember. Get ready for the next battle. You feel like that would be your downfall? I will still say that my uh, I've I've performed better in this game than others. Than Street Fighter, than Round One. Than Guild Gear. So we're watching a replay. I'm the Steve on the left. My opponent is the Lily on the right. I'm pretty sure I got fucking my ass wiped with this person. I don't remember whether or not I won or lost. But a lot of Steve is trying to figure out how to play, and he's a big counter hit character, so I want to catch people while they're trying to attack me. Uh, the problem I have is that I don't personally know any combos. Also, I was there in a stance that I couldn't block in. So I was guaranteed to lose. KO. Round two. Now, because I've Fight. been trying to punish, here's where it shows the showcase of the replay feature. It paused it and told me right now what a recommended combo is. And if I want, I can see what that looks like and if i want further i can try it i duck in i counter hit up i press up back three to hit in the air during that shuffling i hit lionheart uppercut and then sonic fang so i want to do There you go. And then we can hit back. And if I wanted, I could even take control of the characters now. But we'll play. It doesn't think what I did was good. I used heat. I understand. Technically, it wasn't. She kept going for that low sweep. I'm not fast enough at blocking it or dodging it. I'm pretty sure she uses it a lot this match and ends up kicking my ass because I still don't understand most of Lily's moves, despite the fact that I was playing her just a few seconds ago and, you know, like did a combo. I don't know how she operates. And that's one of the reasons that I thought, okay, I got to a rank where I'm getting stuck from not knowing combos. Do I try other people out and see how they feel? But I'm also on a different controller and maybe the issues I have with Steve can not be that bad. I don't know. 
We ended up playing four times, so definitely I did win something because it wasn't a best of three, it was a best of five. But the punishments, the recommended punishes, if I was not going for punishes like I was in those fights, it actually would have paused just like the sample combos and it would have been like, hey, for this character, you should duck because they go middle, 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 and at the end of the string, they hit with a high, and you can duck that. I've had that happen. So let's let's look at these characters. Because my question is, what interests you? What Who do you play in Strive, and why do you play them? What is it about your character that you like? Hmm. So I'm trying to figure out, like, if I was to play anyone else, I need to figure out what Lily's quarter circle forwards are and other moves like that. Nina Williams. Let's get this over with. Get ready for the next Cuz maybe checking out a few of her moves wouldn't be a bad idea. Hmm. The tracking mid. Oh. Can't do it while back turned. Is that three three? Because it's into do glide, right? We do a core circle forward. We do glide. So what's the damage on this? 28? Is that right? Wow. And it is a tornado. But it's a tornado. Hmm. I will say one of the issues I run into Steve is pressing his one, two, one and how fast I need to be doing that. I mean, I'm kind of like used to it now and you can flicker cancel. So I don't know how much I would want to like play a different character, but I need to more figure out what her uh, just regular ass moves are. Combo on hit, combo on hit. Is there a counter hit? What's this one? So down forward to launcher like classic. 16 frame launcher. Back. One, four, three. Okay, maybe it's kind of easy to remember that because it's one, four, three, two. And then I hold forward for do glide, and then I end with do glide as one three, which is like common. Okay, so let's display this while training. So that's the launcher. It's not a back turn. Okay, so I got to get my timing right. Because after this move, if I hold back, don't I just back turn? Yeah, because it's a big thing with Lily. She has all of her moves in back turn. Hmm, okay. So it's another timing thing. All right, let's see. Down forward to... Uh, 
I was holding back. Oh, fuck. Does that not work? No, it doesn't, because back three. So I can't just hold back and then spam it. I have to be more conscious about what I'm pressing. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> fuck. What is Dew Glide again? It is. After the hit? Yeah, and then press in. I do like how it wants you to learn the game. I wish I was something Guilty Gear Strive did. Yeah, uh, I can't tell you the amount of times that I sat there practicing Axel, Axel Lowe has a move that he can use only when in midair. Mantis? No. Axel Bomber. That move, he can only use midair. It's a flaming uppercut. It's fucking fantastic. It's basically a dragon punch, but he can only use it midair. That is the one that taught me about button buffering, but I had to go out of my way to learn that. The game didn't tell me. It didn't lead me into it. And because of button buffering, I could learn that because it was a quarter circle forward, but I needed to be mid-air, I was able to do a quarter circle forward and then jump. Not jump first. And if I did a quarter circle forward and then jump and got the timing right and felt that out, because it's input buffering, it reads that I already did it, Axel would jump into the air with basically a short hop and instantly be doing this flaming uppercut that can only be used mid-air. It was awesome. But I had to teach myself that. Oh, I don't need a dash in for that move? I didn't realize my legs were that long. Sorry, I'm also trying to get used to the buttons for this controller. So I have to like hold back and press A to like reset match, for example. Okay, that was it. I just got the timing wrong. That's the thing I really like about the Dew Glide is out of Dew Glide, I can press one, three, or sorry, one, four. And so during certain moves, if I hold forward, I do that little like, that move, see right here, right there, that's that black arrow. That black arrow indicates I need to hold it down. That's it. It's just she was against the wall, so she got wall splat and it didn't count. All right. There you go. 55 damage, three star combo. Yeah, that's the only thing about Lily. I just don't know what, like, uh, other moves are. I can do a combo. Sure, whether or not I remember it in the middle, I don't know. But she has her back turn stance, and I got to learn, like, what moves are good at a back turn. Because I can do that, but that's 21 and 26 frames, you know? Like, this is cool and all, but that's 29 frames. So Stan's characters are nutty. Wamey, every single character in Tekken is a Stan's character. Legitimately. Whether it's small or little, it's why it's, why it's a thing. Stephen Fox. Let's get this over with. Let me show you. You're familiar with boxing. So this will make this a lot easier. Steve Fox is a boxer. He has no kick buttons. These are his kicks. Now you might be like, oh, 
But everybody can sidestep. Sure, but this is the normal sidestep. That's his sidesteps. Put them together. Albatross. So, I got my punches. Here, let, let me let me think how I want to try this. He has three stances. Peekaboo, Lionheart, and Flicker. I don't think there's more. If there are, I forget their names, but it doesn't really matter. Peekaboo has different properties. I'm not crouching, so I can't be hit by a mid attack. I'm still technically standing but my profile has changed. And if I press one, two together, that's actually a grab. But the example that I have is that let's say I do one, two, three. I can hold forward and suddenly I'm in peekaboo. So a lot of Tekken is knowing that you have these moves that you can go into, right? So... Knowing that I have, like, peekaboo, for example. If I press the one, the two, the punches, I'm still in peekaboo. I do the grab. We saw it. I went out. I do this mid. I'm still in it. I'm still in it. That was an extra duck. Because that's another stance, right? Technically, he has ducking. It's not really a stance to me. It's more like a condition, but it counts. Because out of duck, I can do different moves. Out of that one, two, one, I can hold back. That little bit right here, that's flicker stance. And I have moves that are inside of that. Then you have, here, I'll flip. So it's, uh, you have his newer one, which is Lionheart. See, it's up back three. The little shuffle. So I have moves that come out of that. That's where the uppercut comes from. A guard break. It's just, it's the whole, the whole character is stances. I mean, you go to all techniques, you see heat system. Here's all the normal moves. Special move moves while crouching. During ducking left. During ducking right. During quick spin, during ducking, during ducking in, during peekaboo, during swaying, during flicker stance, during Lionheart, and then you finish it with your throws. So, yeah. It's fun. I just think it's uh it's one of those things where you gotta take it in piecemeal. Like I don't I still don't know full characters' movesets, but they all change in drastic ways. One of the biggest examples of that is probably the newest character. Uh well, you know, one of the new characters, Reyna. Reyna is one that I think you can just know. You could probably know like maybe 10, 12 moves and still climb high. I, I, this goes for a lot of characters because it's all I was doing. You just need to perform better. Safe to assume you got to like pick a character and kind of stick with it because no two characters play the same. Yeah, I mean, for the most part, to be honest, it's one of those where like almost everybody will give this adv uh, advice in most fighting games, but it's like really, really true in this one is pick the character you want to play because every fucking character is going to be hard to learn so pick one you actually want to play let's see I forget there's one of the moves we're holding forward just puts her in a oh it was right there after I do that Maybe it wasn't. I don't know. 
But Reyna, for example, has this whole thing where like this is just mashing the two key. Like there, there are a few newcomers, um, Vincent and Azusena, but primarily Vincent, where like he has a lot of strings that are just pressing the same button over and over again. And they're like really good. I don't remember how to do any of her stuff. I want to see. Yeah. Look at this. Heat moves. Okay. So you got normal moves. I think she has the most. I think she has like 180, something like that. Let's see. While rising. During Wind God Step. So you have all that stuff in Wind God Step. You have Sentai. Unsoku. All right. So down. Down three. Like that right there is a stance. I don't know what I could do out of it. I didn't really read it, I'll be honest. <laughs> I was just going to press buttons until one of them worked. But it counts. I mean, that's... That's a stance. Let's see, what's the wind god step? Forward. Just that forward, by the way, is a stance right there for her. That moving forward, even though this is me holding forward, but if I just tap it, it's the start of her wave dash, which is right there, the little electric. And then you can uppercut. If you get the timing right, you have to press the two button as soon as you press the diagonal at the exact same frame. And if they're the same frame, uh, it's electric. I am not good at it. I haven't practiced it. Uh, but I know if you're in heat, her uh, uppercuts are automatic electric. So that's what it looks like as an example. What's crazy about those is they hit high. So you like get to crouch in. It's just for a second. You can see right here, that line that's standing. For one second, I'm crouching. Sorry, I couldn't do it with my other hand. So yeah, it's, it's interesting. I don't I just don't know. I feel like it's harder to pick up a character because I don't know Tekken that well. Whereas in like Guilty Gear Strive, you just kind of need to know some specials and then you know you I knew the universals of Guilty Gear a lot more. Like 6P is upper body invincibility. I understand that there's launchers and stuff in this game. It's just applying it. Also, uh, let me bring, for example, I'll show Victor real quick. Let's get this over with. Get ready for the next battle. I've never played him, but I'm pretty sure it's just his two string. Might want to try out the ninja guy or law. You're going to love to see the ninja guy. I'm pressing the two button. You can see it right there. That's all I'm doing. That's the one button. That's the three button. That's the four button. Why the fuck is this a whole string? And did you see that? His sword was in there. I'm not holding it. I just waited to pull it out. All right, so Victor is like French. And he's like a ninja guy or whatever the fuck, but he has way more things than he needs and teleportation. And yeah, he's cool. So he's the master of the ninja guy. Ninja guy is uh, Raven. Fights with ninjutsu. I'll have to check the move list to remember how to do his moves, but he literally can send out shadow clones as part of his move list. Raven. Oh, no, I didn't want to select. I just wanted to go back so I could show the 
outfits. Uh, this was his one from the previous game. Then they have a special outfit. And then here's my customization. Commencing mission. Victor Chevalier. Allons-y. Get ready for the next battle. Let me check out his moves. Oh, also, by the way, this might be a selling point to you, might not be. Uh, you have the... Oh, I made a thing for everybody. Some people I went back and made multiples, but I made one for everybody, at least, a minimum. Um, every character in the game you can give a tan to, and for certain characters... Look, you can give a tan in the previous game. But they decided to add the ability for pretty much every male in this game to get a boozy fade. And so if you give them the tan with the fade, they're light skin. And like, I'll be honest, it's fucking awesome. I'll have to show for an example, but like, it's, it's really funny. <laughs> All right. Um, I have to remember during shadow sprint. Okay, so a shadow sprint is uh their special inputs, their core circle forwards. Uh I know he has a ninjutsu thing. Normal moves. Okay. Soul I need to figure out how to get it in a soul zone. Soul zone is three plus four. Literally, that's a stance. Three plus four, or while crouching. And then we get into soul zone. And then you can see on the right, for like this move, for example, it says extra stuff. So it's forward, two, three. But then it also gives you an option where if you do four, two, three, black arrow means hold, and then hold down, you will go into the Nujutsu soul zone. So that very similar to Lily where I was doing those dashes is like knowing what moves kind of go into a stance. Okay, so I want during soul zone moves. During shadow sprint. Moves during soul zone. Okay, check this out. That was a teleport. That was a teleport, but then he's facing back, so he's in back stance. So he has access to his back stance moves. That's a grab. Yeah, and then you have the shadow sprint moves. Let's see, where are they at? Nope, they were down. It's just shadow sprint. And you have all of those shadow moves out of it. That's a throw. Oh, here, I'll, I'll replay the back one before. So that, for example, you'll see he turned his back. Yeah, it's a big thing. Um, for fun, I'll show you the heat move, because uh, if you like the shadow clones, you will enjoy that he has probably one of the coolest looking heat moves. You've seen, sorry, not heat, not heat. Though I will show the heat. Heat's a new mechanic. The rage is this special, is the cutscene one. Um, I meant rage. So that's heat burst. And then you have your heat move. So 
So that's not the cutscene one. This is. You won't see this coming. See. Nothing personal. He says, go to hell and then nothing personnel kids you in the exact same fucking line. Yeah, hey, he's neat. That's just quarter circle forward A, and it's a throw. Like, if you can do quarter circle forwards from Shrive, which I know you can do. Yeah, I think, uh... I think it's one of those things where you just like you have a character they get really cool let me show you the character customization like i was talking about i will do the main character because it is the most obvious on just how funny because it uh just doesn't you just wouldn't expect it. All right. Body. Tan. You follow? You see that online a lot. Almost just that combination <laughs> you will see some other stuff uh because he's one of the only characters that has brown eyes because you can't you cannot choose any of those colors like that's what you see but you will see like this a lot and it makes sense it's ty Zell. There you go, man. <laughs> like, I mean, you can dress them up and do everything else. I just don't play the characters. I don't give a fuck. I think the person that I find it the funniest with, though, is Jack. Jack 8 is a uh, awkwardly sized robot. The proportions do not match what you would assume a normal person has. He's like a straight gorilla with the way that his arms are just like longer than his legs. <laughs> Here. Do the eyes. There's the tan. I need to get rid of the, the head thing. I think it's his face. No, it's glasses. Okay. Like, why is he, why does he look like that? <laughs> He's shaped so weird, man. But yeah, I can't really figure out who, um, who I was feeling. I might really just have to go online and play more Steve or some other who else. Cause like you think about it and you're just like, fuck. We'll have to, to fight no matter what. Because I heard Lars is pretty cool. Honestly, there was a character I thought you'd like. Oh, who's that? It was actually Lars. Oh, yeah. I think I'm in practice mode still. Lars was interesting. I will say the only reason that I can tolerate most characters is because I can customize them. Like hardcore, the way Lars looks, I would not have picked him ever. Ever. Literally ever. Okay, he does not have a 
dash. But he, I forget what the move is. He's got this like crazy, like lightning shit he can do. Okay, well that's part of it. See, I thought it was a dash in, and then I am surprised to find out that that is not the case. That's your heat. Just one, one, one activates heat. Third attack hits when first attack is a counter hit. That's crazy. And then the, oh, so dynamic entry is his lightning. I can get a counter hit on block if somebody blocks my heat. Holy crap, that's the thing I've gotten hit with by a lot. Did 35 damage. This gameplay is just so weird. See, the thing that gets me yes uh i don't know how well i'd be at doing combos for him but to be honest i think that kind of goes for almost every character hold on display while training nope there we go so it's up forward four forward one two three so forward one, two, three. And then I went lightning. So I think that's counted as dynamic entry. I should change the stage actually. Cause I keep having to reset cause we had the wall. I like the way that stage looks and I like the way the music is, but um, we need a bigger map. Get ready for the next battle. Probably should have done the Coliseum. I even hovered over it too. I just find this one prettier. I think the call seems technically larger. I have to refine that, don't I? Nope, not a combo challenge. It was a main technique combo. It was this one. All right, so it was forward, forward one, two, three. How soon do I need to press 1-2 during dynamic entry? That's the forward move if I keep holding forward. Is that... Is that it? Brother, I have no idea. Oh no, it was it. But then he has a while rising and then a hold forward into silent entry and it's like, ah, oh, kill me. Well, his armor is a one, two. I mean, I don't know, that's the thing. Like every single character obviously has something that is cool about them. And, you know, I don't know, like everybody's neat in this game. So it's almost hard to say for sure. Like, okay, I played Strive recently and I actually played Soul Bad Guy and just played a classic fucking Ryu Street Fighter, like, you know, Fireball, um, his Dragon Punch, like, just kept it classic. And I played against Swift, and I was actually winning majority of the matches with a character I've never fucking played because I was just treating him like default flowchart Ken, you know? Whereas I'm the person who typically plays 
Axel Low, Bridget, Elfelt twice now. I like her. I just haven't really like played the game. Well, I like her, but then her Rekka starts from a high, like it's an overhead. I just feel like it's so easy to punish with a 6P in that game. So your, hold on, your challenge two is... What the fuck? Why can't I do that? Why is the character pausing? There we go. Oh, forward three does dynamic entry. Okay. Oh, shit. I have to be a lot faster at that. Oh, it's a one, two. Yeah, her Rekka is nuts. It's why I liked uh, Jamie from Street Fighter, because he has a Rekka, too. But I was playing Ed more recently because um, I liked Steve, and so the boxer character felt very nice. But Jamie is who I was mostly playing, which is funny because I didn't think I would be more into Jamie. I thought I would have liked Kimberly. Kimberly is a little similar to Master Raven, where, you know, she does her sprint. He sends out the clones. And if the clone hits or her sprint hits, you know, she built. Yeah, off of Street Fighter six. Um, then they kind of start their game plan from there. But no, I ended up liking Jamie, which was really cool. I think uh, I get into some matches and see how I feel about Steve. I know I should like do more before that, but it's uh, it's been a minute. We haven't gone in. The only thing I want to keep in mind, I'm at warrior rank now. Which is like what? Silver, I think it equates to. You could start losing LP now. So I could lose and uh, go back. Yeah, I think the big thing is the execution in like the button presses per minute that I feel like is necessary for me to do in Street Fighter and Guilty Gear is a lot higher. And so it kind of feels a bit more overwhelming. Which I definitely recognize. And it might just be gaslighting because I don't have to press as many buttons in this game. Yeah, so we talked about buffering, right? In Street Fighter, this was the case. Guilty Gear, not, not too much. But like in Street Fighter, this was the case where let's say I'm throwing out a move like my punch and it could be canceled into a special. Because of button buffering in Street Fighter, let just to illustrate it, I don't know. Let's let's call that my my special, okay? Just for the sake of this. I could be throwing out this move. And if I press the duck and it cancels as a special, it will cancel if it hits, right? Because if this person is blocking and I'm pressing like 1/3, it's not happening because they blocked like it didn't connect so what you'll have or at least i did a lot in street fighter is that you're like pressing one move and then mashing like not even mashing but like really doing a quarter circle forward every single fucking time 
I'm pressing this so that if my move hits, I immediately canceled it into a special. And so I found myself just like constantly playing the game, which was cool. But I was doing like five matches a day. And then I was like, I'm spent. <laughs> like I'm I'm good. I need to I need to get out of here. I need to go home. No Wi-Fi. What's the... Oh, that's the move. So it's back, forward, 3-2. That's when I swing on someone. Okay. We'll see how I feel. Oh, Whoring. Person I constantly lose to because he is the example of offense and I need to know how to deal with him and I don't know how to deal with him. It's also a lot harder on me because he's the kicking character and I'm the punching character. Oh, okay. I was being patient on you. Oh, I'm doing the move wrong. Yeah, that one gets you a lot. Round two. Fight. I dodged. God, I don't remember a lot. I was practicing Lily too much. Oh, I went for the wild rising. Yep, and then that puts me in Lionheart, which in Lionheart stance, I can't block. God damn it. That's a high. Okay. He throws that kick out so fast that I don't know like what to expect. And then a low sweep. So still in block stun, I'm pretty sure. Let's see. But yeah, I really struggle against this character. Like, actually, I think after this, this will be interesting for me to go back and do a uh, a replay analysis. Oh shit, that's a grab. It's the low every time. I think that's one thing that actually gets me in a game like this is that I will kind of rely on the characters moving in a way that makes sense to me for me to be like, oh, they're going to dodge or hit this way. And then I got to remind myself that like, no, still an anime game they could throw out a fucking move that they decide to happen in like three seconds gotcha i'll get some recoverable health back which is a thing in this game but uh i'm basically gonna lose to the next low Yeah, that little white that was around him is armor. Fuck. Even in peekaboo. 
Oh shit, that was a counter to my grab. I thought I was close enough. I'm trying different stuff because I'm clearly just losing. But the way that Steve plays is traditionally different than everybody else because he doesn't have a down forward to launcher. So like this, this move for most people knocks him up into the air. Steve does not have that. I have to duck in and then press it. So it it's not like a go-to knock them up and start a combo and so it's one of the only reasons that i was like hey man i might like steve but that doesn't mean that i'm actually good at him is there somebody better that i could perform with and that's that's what i was mostly kind of curious about but it's hard to tell because everybody's so di difficult in their own character brother Oh, I tried to go in for the long one. Why not try out each character and see what stands out? I, I think it's mostly execution for me. Like, I don't... I'm not sure to know what character stands out, because... Um, it's whether or not I can perform well. Brother, you... Oh, my God. Hate that I'll die to that. constant grabs and i'm just breaking out of most but not all grabs and uh combos are the things that get me oh i pressed the button thought i could sneak in bitch if you don't I always go for way too much. But I think that's something that speaks to the strength of Tekken, is that every character is so varied. Fish I can grab too. Like, what I could get out of everybody is really just dependent on how well I could perform, right? Oh, shit. That might be one of his one-two grabs. I'm not sure. Yeah, I just parried your punch. What's up? What do you want? <laughs> Yeah, I was trying to, I figured he'd just do the same thing. So I was like, all right, how do I counter? God damn it. And I lost. I haven't played Steve in so long that I'm actually sitting here like, damn. <laughs> how do I do everything? Okay, let's see. I got 2-2, two, two, which we don't necessarily love. But it is notable, because it puts us in a lion heart, which means I can't break. Or I can't um, block. I have back one, that hook right there, which is a counter hit. Knew that was coming. Because I got one, two, one. One, two, one, two, two, one. Back one, but I don't know a combo if I get the counter hit. Which might be an up back three into Lionheart, and then I just do a twister there, but I'm not really sure. Ooh. Because I kind of just go for that normally. Mm -hmm. 
Wow. Oh my god, man. Holy shit, nice. All right, I'm pretty sure you can block this. Yeah, and then you grab me. It counts as a counter. I can't break out of it if it's a counter, which is a little white flash and that little sound. Oh, I wanted to step on his toes. And I really should have just pressed two faster so that I actually could... Ooh. Incorporate more of the side dashes. Yeah, the hard part is that if I remember right, I don't, while you're doing the side dash, you're not blocking. And there are some moves that even if they don't have the special trail, um, they could still sweep. Like if my leg physically sweeps, even if it wasn't intended on being a tracking move, it could still hit because it's such a 3D space game. I'm just trying to keep up the offense. And you tend to go for the grab, so at least I know that like that back two will throw me back. Oh, shit, I got the grab wrong. But I did incorporate it like you want. Oh, and then I got grabbed again. Okay. See, I'm like, I'm blocking right, but whether or not I'm doing the proper punish, is it down to timing or choice? That I'm not sure of. And then I lose out to a grab anyways. Oof. And that's one of the reasons that I was kind of like, all right, I like Steve because I could play small Tekken, right? I don't need to worry too much about um, hitting any of the big hits, but like, you know, what am I missing? Now, I will say Azucena, who I had across from me, is a very popular choice at being brain dead. Because she's, her and Elisa are very strong for that. What they have in the game and what they offer is insane. Elisa's like, she has this chainsaw mode that she really doesn't need. It's just, she just doesn't need it. Um, but she does, and she does insane chip damage. I don't know if I can, like, illustrate that at all. But that's somebody that I could probably, like, you know, play and, and carry through to some extent. But Elise is also an example of somebody who moves in such an unnatural way that I'm... No, it's hard for me to keep track of if I'm fighting against them. All right, how do you bring out the chainsaws again? Is it a down? Oh, right. I forgot that I'm still technically looking for a match. Heat combo. Heat, 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 heat. No, you're not going to show me. You just have to get out. Quick gym, heat burst, uninstall. That's the head. Shift to destructive form. Forward, three, two. Three, one plus two, I mean. Mm. The big gimmick from what I'm aware of in this form is that I cannot block, but 
That's just pressing one. And that doesn't do chip. Well, what if Azucena blocks? Oh, I'm not. Training mode. Standing block. I don't really know what her chainsaw moves are. I'm not sure. I mean, it's not really a character anyways that I was particularly curious about. I was just more checking it out. I will say, having used this um, hot controller, I do marginally prefer it than playing on my keyboard. It's a lot more comfortable in a very positive way. All right, Reyna, let's check out your list of moves again. Azucena. Azucena has a lot of back turns, but maybe with Heaven's Wrath, I can understand Reyna more. We'll see. The only, only thing that you have to keep in mind, Reyna's one of the most played characters. So a lot of people will be better and more used to what she has as an option. Let's see. So that starts high. Minus four, minus 11s. Now, wait a moment. This is, this isn't the boxing dude from last week. You mean? Yeah, no, I'm, uh, I'm bouncing around and trying to see other characters, how I feel. We did just play Steve and I got my ass wiped with me twice. So it's one of those where I'm like trying to revisit the idea of, um, you know, is, is he the best option for me? I mean, I am able to do, you know, the uppercut, the wind god fist, not the electric wind god fist. Okay, never mind. I just did it. I just did it again. I just did it again. Wait, hold on. Okay, let me look at this. Forward. Forward down forward so it's forward into down forward and i need to press two at the same time that i press down forward Oh, weird. That's mood. I may or may have not have unlocked, spent money to get everyone on Shrive to see who else I vibe with. You know, Wamey's here too, and we were talking about Shrive the whole day. It's like, man, y'all got me tempted to just get on Shrive and fucking play. Because then we could play together. What are these? Do I need to know anything else? No. You know what? Fuck it. Match settings. Ranked match on. I don't need to know Reyna. Fuck you. I can just press 222 over again. Time to climb the Shrive ladder. Hey, Wamey, what rank are you? Like, what uh, what floor are you on the ladder? No, fuck off, Wi-Fi. Oh, he has to hit us with that, so that means that's not good. Oh, 
a fight Wi-Fi, which you could just turn off. While my break, I'm back to floor eight. Yeah, see, that's the thing. Um, I was placed on like three or four and then only played like three ranked matches. And that's what's really funny to me, Wamey, because the way that you, yeah, the way he feels about, oh, I'm not sure if I'd like Tekken is like, brother, you are better at fighting games than the average person. You could actually pick up any fighting game you want and excel. Quite literally being at floor 10 tells you that. That's armor. So nice. Let's see. One, one, two, two. I mean, I'm not saying that in a way that I want you to play a different game. I'm just acknowledging that like you have, you have skill, maybe more than you'd like to admit, but it is there. Down one plus two is heaven's wrath. Wait, what? What? No, no. Now you want to hit me with a match? Okay. Oh, I want to know what I can do out of that. Okay. This game puts me on strategist rank because my Steve is a minimum. Heaven's wrath is this mode where she's like very angry and double handsy. Uh, she has a lot of stances. Like, I was speaking um, prior about how every single character in this game is a stance character. I don't... If you're just gonna attack, I don't need to learn how to play the game. See? That was Heaven's Stance, high tracking. Uh-oh. Okay. Fuck. What was that move I did back? What was that? That's a tracking? I'm just like waiting to see when you're gonna stop blocking. Oh, it looks like I could have continued from that. Let me try. Oh, I can. Oh, that's easy. Well, it might not be a lot of damage, but there's my example of being able to do a launcher that Steve couldn't do, or at least I wasn't able to do with him, and I can just press two. Woo! If learn what my fast punish is, it might be one one, I don't know. I could do back one and find out. Wanted the armor. Now, will you go again for the low sweep? Because you know that you caught me on it. I think you will. Oh, never mind. I'm wrong. Well, that counts. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't expect to put that, like, put me in a full running with that, but okay. Fight. I don't know where to apply the pressure with wave dashing. I think it's just the fact that I know how to do it makes me feel like I need to do it. Because, I mean, if it works, it's a counter hit. Maybe it's just because I'm so used to Steve being like, yeah, I got to wave in. I'm sorry. Whoa, whoa. 
Is my back against the wall? What happened right there? Uh oh. We're to catch up after a hard knockdown. Oh, maybe to like probably introduce like a 50 50 that I'm just not aware of. Uh oh. Yeah, make them guess. Oh, yeah, that is another thing is that um, Tekken is a lot more actionable rock, paper, scissors than most of the other fighting games I've experienced. Okay, I went down, but that's low was a lot slower than I thought. I literally ducked to block and then failed <laughs> hey get in there again that was cool um Ole Miss every character is like just they have a ton of 50 50s raw ass throwing 50 50s out there like you are I don't know you're playing a guessing game a lot but you do get to introduce like conditioning your opponents which is cool Oh, I tried to go for a big move. Oh, you have a fist counter? I don't know much about Fang. I heard Fang's really fucking cool, but I also heard he was broken in seven. I was waiting for him to press a button, so I just did the whole fucking combo for that final one. Uh. Ooh. I need to learn something. Okay, Heaven's Wrath 1 puts a tracking high. God damn it, fucking low. The low that's telegraphed as hell, but I'm staring at my character because I don't know what I can do. You're in a GG mood now? Well, now that I know that you're on um, floor 10, I think I need to stay offline and never play. You're on floor eight. Yeah, and I'm like three or two, my man. Uh, I know how to put in specials. I just don't know how to play the game. You feel me? I don't know what any of my... Oh, fuck. Okay, this is bad. Yeah, and then you get guaranteed shoulder. Fang's shoulder is something that's very popular, but how do you counter it? Wait, what is that? Is that a taunt? Press the wrong button. Because I recently changed that other button. What's my counters? There's the low. Nice. I'm just throwing moves out. That was really good on him. One thing I haven't done is I have not played Strive since getting this. I wonder how well I play it, Axel. This is the uh, Hot 42. It's one of their S or G models with 16 buttons. Uh, you can get it for basically 50 bucks. And it's, I highly recommend it. You can get a larger one if you want a, a larger surface area. They're T16. I also, I would recommend getting a 16 button one over a 12 button because the difference is like $10 and you might as well get the extra buttons. Um, but Hot recently came out and is very popular because they are a lot cheaper and more affordable than most other options that are available on the market right now. Uh, because 
they're a Chinese brand. And quite literally, you need to get them on either an Amazon reseller or um, AliExpress. I did AliExpress because they had a deal for when you like bought your first thing on it, you get like extra off. So it quite literally cost me 50 bucks with shipping. Oh, I need to learn the... Oh, is it Heaven's Wrath that does the ground stance? Nice. Cool. Round three. Bitch, if you want to play right now, I will get on. <laughs> I'm at this point, like, I just want to play fighting games with friends, man. But ain't nobody got fucking Tekken. Everybody's still a Guilty Gear. <laughs> It's killing me. <sighs> nice, Xiao Yu. That was actually sick. You deserve that. Fight. Yeah, because I could show Wei Mi what I was talking about with the button buffering, too, which is crazy because, like, I'm just a marginally worse player, but, uh, like, He's in a much better position because he's just a more solid fighting game player, which I think is like awesome because that means think about the amount of improvements that like Waymi could have, for example. Gotcha. You know you wanted you know you thought I was gonna go for rage. And I never will. Well, I shouldn't lie. But that's what keeps them on their toes. I need to learn a punishment for Reyna. I, crazy, I actually enjoy playing as her right now. Maybe it's just because I'm hot. I think I like that. I'm pretty attractive. Oh, I wanted my armor move. <gasps> Does this work? I don't think so. No. And then, yeah. It was worth a shot. I wasn't confident. I don't know half the moves I got. Run it back, please. I have not fought against a, like low rank Xiao Yu that didn't just curb my asshole immediately, so I really enjoy this. Round one. Fight. What other moves do I have? What's like an up back three? <laughs> do I just start pressing Steve buttons? <laughs> See what comes out? Oh shit, maybe not. Brother, I can't breathe for a second. to deal with your fucking bullshit okay cool i saw art of the phoenix and i was like oh get the fuck away that's when xiao yu goes super low and you need to use low attacks in order to hit her because she's in this like perma crouching profile the problem is the inconsistent that like inconsistency that a lot of people have uh with the game and xiao yu in specifics is the fact that a lot of low moves will still not hit her because her profile is just so awkward. Oh. I missed the, the grab. OK. 
Okay. What'd you miss? She threw, oh, she threw out Nari the Phoenix and she scared the shit of me. That was Heaven's Wrath. There you go, you dropped your block. That's all I needed. Fight. Oh, went for the armor move, but it doesn't come out fast. Good to know. Gotcha. Okay, run it back. Best of three. That's the first one I got a Reyna. Come on, run it. Run it, 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 run it. Must have like streamer mode on or something because everybody's names are just a bunch of numbers. <laughs> I knew I could backflip. Yeah, you thought every single time I go for it, it's going to be an uppercut? Not necessarily. I probably should have just grabbed. I have no idea what a low move is for me. Maybe down one. That's what it is for Steve. Let's see. Uh, no, it looked medium. Down forward one looks medium too. Could be a high. I don't know. Let's try it. Oh, what stance did that put me in? I don't know the name of it. Like Sh Sh Ushoku or something? I might be thinking of somebody else. <laughs> I tried the backing one. Oh, nice. Woo! Does her hands have extra long fingernails or fucking what? Oh, shit. I need to learn some of these girls' moves, baby. feel like I'm far enough and then she brings out those like legs I'm not familiar with <sighs> just hit her with that two string over and over again hope for the best right got that Got you. Ooh, I'm gonna die to the grabs. And then the low pressure. Actually, I'm gonna die to this. I'm gonna get grabbed here, yeah? Yep. Okay. Reading it. Could read myself too easy. Yeah, it'd be tight to try out um, some of the other fighting games, too, to see how it performs with this controller. Because we, we're new with it, and I'm seeing. It is weird having a larger space, right? Because I used to play on keyboard. So it's like ASD right next to each other in a way that I also have to make sure to not hit other buttons. God forbid I fucking touch tab or caps lock. Uh, and I used to play on the numpad for the other one. But... 
yeah if you uh if you want to hop on guilty gear i don't mind i'm down to do that right now all right let me do that Do 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 Where's markers? Where's a marker? You're replying to yourself? That's so fair, man. I like this song. This song is nice. Guilty Gear is also an ultra wide game that I cut off. Yes. Yes. I think so. Yeah, no, seriously, like if if you got to the point that you learned more of the available skills that fighting games have and you already were at such a solid place, it would be crazy to see your improvement. Like, there's just no way that you wouldn't, I don't know, just kick ass. Does this game want to go online? <laughs> what the hell? All right, real quick. Let's do this. Oh, I don't have to do all the different... my keyboard count as player too it's weird uh let me show the axle thing real quick that i was talking about to me how do i get out of here what color is it it's either nine eleven Let me see if I can get my inputs to show up, too. Did I like Bedman? I'm biased. I think Bedman is a Pokemon trainer issue. Hear me out. I hate that his sister is in the way. She causes so much visual noise it's very hard for me to focus when delilah is just running in the foreground i need her to like not be present because that's probably my only issue in facing off against a bed man now this might have been the fact that like i've only ever faced off against like five and it's my fault because i haven't played the game a lot but like all right let me see Axel Bomber. Here it is. So it's a heavy slash. And you can only do it midair. It's a quarter circle forward. You can see me go down and forward and press it. Now here's the cool part. This game's execution is a lot more lenient than Tekken in terms of when I press the buttons, though. Because look. I do the forwards. Do you see how late I'm pressing that H8? Like, heavy slash? It's not even next to the button inputs. Like, you can see when it's next to it, like that, right there, the most recent one, all the way up at the top. But I'm not even doing that. I'm, I'm waiting. I'm, like, putting it in and then falling down to the ground. Okay. But I need to be in the air. So this is button buffering. It's a quarter circle forward heavy slash. You can see my inputs right there. You can see that I am doing the quarter circle forward. I'm down, down, forward, forward. What if I do this and then jump? 
and then hit the button when I'm in the air. Frame fucking one type bullshit. I mean, brother, it's a smash ultimate short hop axle bomber. And look, what is that, 87 damage? Is that right? Yeah. That's what you gotta learn too. I recommend because you can visually see it with him. Do it with Axel right now. Go in training and do it with Axel. And the reason being is because this one, well, this one's not a, a dragon punch, by the way, but this one can only be used midair. So you know whether or not you did it. But yeah, the, um, the Zs are basically for me, because I play like leverless or keyboard, um, if you look at your keyboard, S and then D, if I just press them fast, S and D, right? Is the quarter circle forward. A Z is just me pressing D first and then SD very fast. And that will count because of button buffering in this game. I don't remember if he has a dragon punch. I don't think so. Because that'd be crazy if a fucking zoner had one, but... Hold on. That's a quarter circle forward. That's so easy. What do you have, Winter Mantis? How do I do Winter Mantis again? Did they add a move to Axel? Wait, no, genuinely, did they add a move? That's new. Whistling win. Launches the projectile in a straight line to the front. Holding K enhances the properties. As it covers a wide range, this move is a great poke. Works well in combos and strings. Is this Oki? Huh? Okay, yeah. Him and Pot got new moves. They got buffed. Pot needed to be buffed, to be fair. Also, what's up? Play <laughs> some BS. All right. Let me do... Um... How do I play this game? Network. <sighs> Player match. Network. Oh my God, man, I'm struggling. I'm trying my best over here. All right, up to you, buddy. I'm asking you, uh, Quebin. Do you want um, Komisidise voice chat? Sorry, I had to open it on my phone because this game plays uh, first full screen and it was being weird. Floor four, what am I? Who you asking? Bitch, it could be you too if you want. Type exclamation point Discord. Because you're not in that server. I don't think. I don't think you are. <laughs> the answer is yes. <laughs> Hello, gamer. Greetings.
Wamey's in it now. What's up? Wamey's in the server now. Oh, fuck yeah. I guess might as well send him the, um... What do you call yeah. it? The code, yeah. I'll just throw it in, um... Drenkov. And wait, me just join, like, uh, the garden or whatever, and I'll drag you down. Make sure I said it is the jail status. Oh, the code? That's oh, a great idea. We don't have oh, access. That's fair. I haven't thought about changing anything. Hey, Wamey. Yo, you hit me with the, it could be you too. And I was like, all right, bet. Yeah, I mean, it good. <laughs> it's all business now. <laughs> I'm going to get fucking washed, but. Dude, it is going to be like the weirdest thing of like, both of us getting fucked. <laughs> No, bro, I freaking, I'm bad, bro. Like, I just went down from floor 8 to floor 6, so, like, I'm bad. I, uh, I've been bouncing between 4 and 5, like, for the past couple days. Like, it sucks. Who, who do you play? I've been playing a lot of Bridget. Fair, fair enough. Mostly only Bridget, but I also just decided to buy the rest of the characters that I've been playing so much. Mm-hmm. No, Bridget's really good. Bridget's, Bridget's 50-50 is freaking crazy yeah did uh anyone else get a new move because i mentioned about seeing um i think full wait see. i'm think... also floor four yeah let me see when did i get floor four i lost like three games and then played street fighter we have to lose in like a consecutive row like if you keep losing you'll you'll go down the floor <laughs> I'm like slowly trying to remember the buttons again. Oh. Do you know any combos with her or anything special? No, I just always started messing with her. Because you unlock the cast, yeah. Yeah, Potemkin got like a stupid little glide. Oh, I've then... seen some funny videos with that. Oops, that's not the move. That was not the call. And then the, the new character is pretty crazy too. FL. Mm -mm. Um, the book guy. Oh, Oscar. Oscar, yeah. He's, yeah. Uh, he's a problem. He literally just throws Tetris at you, and you have to figure it out. Yeah, so I think it's only Pot, uh, Potemkin, and Axel that got named. Wait, I think... Geo That's my 6P. Okay, there we go. I think Giovanna can Giovanna can be pretty impre uh, oppressive. Oh, yeah. How do I get out of here? No. I don't remember... what my... special is. Uh, you do. Of course, circle back for like forward. Heavy slash. Or not quarter circle, half circle back, forward, um, heavy slash. Kind of like that very standard one. Her other one's weird. It's double quarter circle forward kick. Yeah, um, and I don't... It's very close for a grab. Yeah. <laughs> Straight at ya. Let's see if that works. Yeah, you got me. Ooh. Oh. Faultless, baby. Oh, yeah, I forgot they added the, uh, like, uh, dust okay. dash. Oh, yeah, like the quarter circle forward thing that goes off the first. There's yeah. also, I've got it, so I can do it. You've got the quarter circle back. Back, uh, block. Really I think it just counters here. Get your burst. So it's quarter circle back dust. Yeah, mm, that's nice. Don't forget about if you, if you hadn't good at like uh, don't forget I've gotten 
pretty in the habit of yellow Roman canceling now. To interrupt strings. Yeah, and you'll get, um, yeah, yellow, yellow is your friend. When they're freaking putting on the pressure, when Chip put, like, for, like, my character, like, Chip, like, when he gets you in the corner, you need to use yellow. Cause, Dude, I, I faced against a Chip that was so annoying. Yeah, Chip can be very, like, Chip Rush down. Much make sure you don't play the game. There's a reason he's got the smallest health pool in the game. Yes, and it's so frustrating because literally Potemkin can kill me in two grabs. <laughs> that literally happened to me today. It was like, bro, I'm on floor eight, about to go to floor nine, and this Potemkin just like, I have to do all this work. My finger, freaking fingers are cramping and everything, and I got grabbed twice. And I was like, <laughs> all right, bro. All right, man. I want to learn Elfeld. Like, she, that, like, what is it? Her Rucka. back, like, slash combo thing she can do. Yeah. It's just oppressive in the corner. That's why I had to learn how to eat uh, Yellow Roman, because I just got, like, stuck in the corner not having fun. Mm -hmm. I don't like, even do know do? if I have an input for a Roman, which I need to see if I can put one because of the controller. Because I got uh, an extra button. If you, if you got an extra button, you could have a Roman cancel button. Mm -hmm. Other than that, it's just the it's just three attacks that aren't dust. Three attacks that aren't dust. That's the problem yes. I have. Is because I'm used to just pressing dust. <laughs> yeah. All right. What are my moves again? Yeah, that move. Which is the most telegraphed one, but if you get caught in it, it feels bad. I always like try to go like, oh, I'm gonna block this, and I forget it comes from behind, so you can't block. You have to jump. Mm -hmm. That lasts for a while. <laughs> yeah, if I charge it. How do you burst again? Uh, it's dust and uh, uh, two attacks. Oh, uh, okay. Best bet, put it, put it on the button. Yeah, honestly, burst is also another good button to have. Yeah, I couldn't remember any of the inputs. No, I get it. Oh, that's just rude, dude. <laughs> <laughs> He's good. I've been trying to get better at, like, oh, they're on the wall, I should super them. But, like, with Bridget, the only one I can usually hit because I get stuck on high wall is the, um, like, the one where you throw it. Mm -hmm. Which is, it does a lot of damage. I'm gonna do, I wanna, I wanna, well, I wanna try this. Oh, try it. I wanna see if I can get it off in a real game. Ooh. I was nope. fast. Was that back? Yeah, it was back. Okay. Yeah. Also, it's like, I don't want to be a dick because I'm like, you still, you're still, like, you're <laughs> relearning your character. I'm like, mm. Here, no, it's all right. Next, I'm next genuinely like, like most, most moves, I'm like, okay. What oh, do I press? Christ. Yeah, he can climb up the walls and it's so yeah. cool. You know one thing I've been trying to get better at is when you do the dust follow up, like the dust jump, mm -hmm. uh, holding up, and you, and you like follow them. I can only get like two or three hits, and I've seen people do like a fuck ton, and I'm like, how do you juggle? I don't know. It's weird. I think it has um, properties you, you have to learn because like Tekken's the same way. Input. You can't use yeah, the same you, button over and over again. And, it yeah, you have like this. if you do two buttons. The same, no, I don't want to fight. Spike them. I want to. Uh, Spectate. How do I sign up to spectate? Go to the book. <laughs> spectate match. Yes. Cool. Okay, cool. Yeah, you're playing Bridget. Because that's your main, yeah. right? Yeah. Well, we'll let Wamey have some fun. I mean, if you <laughs> like, if you like um, Chip, then you would genuinely like Raven because they have the similar play style in my opinion i would also say kimberly like literally all the ninja characters they make the same throughout the games nice valid hmm i wonder if i'm in the way because for tekken 
It's all right. The supers for, and stuff, yeah. For Guilty Gear, I might be a little too Jesus large. Christ. Yeah, Chip's, Chip's fast. Chip's fucking dumb, Chip's dude. Chip's freaking fast, dude. Also, freaking... He's old freaking... enough to win in and out, isn't he? Yes. Also, freaking... Your fo that move, like your forward 6P is your friend, because you get so much a uh, freaking... Uh... Damn it. <laughs> oh, dude, I didn't get it. Um... Your 6P gives you so many, so much iframes too, and you can move forward while doing it too. I don't, rem I don't know what Bridget 6P is, but uh, it's where she turns a little bit and like brings the yo-yo from the top. It's a side swipe. Oh, okay, it's a side yeah. swipe. Okay. It's a great anti-air. Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ, Chip is oppressive. I haven't played against like a like a good chip. I the one I played like would like cheap do stuff and like I'd be like, okay, I know how to read this now. <laughs> it was I am floor four. I think it was a floor three chip that was still like basically perfect the first stock, and then I was like, wait, I understand what you're doing, kind of. Yeah. But when like, you when you get to the high, like the higher floors, you know how like in Dragon Ball Z, you know how like it would be like Goku versus like Freezer or something, and everybody's eyes are like tracking the fight. That's yeah. quite literally how it is playing against a chip play in the higher levels. Because you're like, bro, I gotta make, I gotta be on point. I gotta make sure I'm watching that for everything. There you go. And this, this freaking shield is your friend. Yeah. Faultless defense. Mm hmm. Think how many times that freaking saved me. Dude, that's just oppressive. Yeah. The fact that it comes from the top at the end. <laughs> I'm not ready for it. And you can <laughs> delay it too, which is crazy. I know. You're going to try to catch me out with it. <laughs> Yeah, the only thing that really sucks for Bridget on the side of her is that her yo-yos have their own hurt box. Yeah. What? Is that a grab? Yeah, it's my command grab. <laughs> oh, you should have punished so like that? Freaking... Yeah, I'm so passive. Do you know how to do um, when you're rolling like a short break? Yeah, like where you like hold down, like and slow down. Yeah. That's, That's the 60. Yeah. Is it? It starts kind of behind her head and goes forward. Like it's a forward arc. Oh wow, that's kind of weird. Yeah. yeah, it's just this. That's. Oh, at least it's fast. Yeah, it's really fast. That was my fault. I wonder how much rolling when your yo-yo is out would put you in danger against Chip. I feel like it... Oh, like going to it? Yeah. It probably a lot. Oh. Uh, I know for like you could bait out because like when you travel the yo-yo you can slow down yeah you can slow down and i've been I... caught i've been caught out by that because usually i try to answer it with my uh with chips back b button mm -hmm. which is a slow startup but it's a hard knockdown but as so many times like they're coming at me and they'll stop and they'll jump and i'm like oh piss she I'm has already a in my move book. where her Ariel is her like kicking with both legs and it's one of the best things to do when you're rolling forward with the yo-yo yeah yeah it's so wide even as just a starting attack too Duel one. Let's rock. Yeah, like, yo, freaking... so, like your 50 50s 
And that's the thing too. You can be freaking oppressive from like half the screen away. Fair. Yeah, I gotta go into settings and add me uh some cancel buttons. Ah, oh, that was the op. I was down. The wall riding is pretty fun. <laughs> And Chip has a Rekka too, right? Mm -hmm. it's, it's that, yeah. Yeah. God, you got me. Just... Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, I've completely zoned out right there. No, <laughs> you fucking flow stated so hard. Uh -oh. Nah, Swift's really good at that. Oh. Yeah. Right into it! Baited! I baited myself. Oh my god. <laughs> I was like, can I? That's fucking wild. I can't get this. I don't know, like, I, I play I play a character like Chip, and then, like, I, that's what frustrates, frustrates me about playing against, like, people that play for tough game, because I'm like, bro, two hits and I'm dead, bro. I have to, my, I have to go through so much. The work you have to put in compared to, um, yeah. So much work. And it's like, yeah, Chip's really fast. Chip does this. But I'm like, bro, one grab, and I'm over. I'm yeah. dead. Done. I'm, I'm so bad at grabbing, and I'm never going to get you with my command grab because it's so Me slow. Me too. I'm, so, I'm bad at grabbing because it's like, in this game, like any other game, you can see the grab happening, so you can react to it. In this game, if you're standing right next to him, it just happens. Almost instantaneously. Ooh. Almost instantaneously. Can I not change controller stuff here? Um, when you go pick a character, you should be able to. Oh, but mm, okay. Let me try that. Mm, mm, nice mix up. Ooh. Oh, I really did just have disaster of passion is the only thing I was playing, huh? Yeah, that's fair. Oh, that was the <laughs> dirtiest stuff I've done in a while, though. <laughs> fair. What fucking button is this? Oh, okay, it was Y. Dude, I was up the skyscraper. <laughs> oh, I had a button. Damn. I six speed too soon. That's the problem with like Chip too. Is like, you get so used to him playing fast. If he slows, he yeah. slows down and trips you up. He like he's like the oh I downloaded how this guy's playing and then you slightly change your tempo and you're screwed. don't know what I prefer for buttons. Ooh. Let's see. I change a shirt on that. Oh, what? I think it's color three. No, oh, it's two. I'm 
I'm not getting perfect, though. That's all I care about. I like how spectate while waiting doesn't actually spectate. Yeah, because you, you have to start the spectate before the match. You want in? Uh, yeah. Alright. I'm... I'm not actually going to really play play. I just I want to see I'll press buttons. Yeah, you remember the um heavy shot cancel into reload twice that yeah. I was talking about. Mm -hmm. Haven't tried it since I got the new controller. Here. Let's Let, me Let me get on the other side just to oh, go okay. off of memory. Okay. Because that goes in. Nope. That's just shooting normally. Yeah, it's a core circle back heavy slash for the other one. It's down, down K or down K to cancel your thing. There we go. There we go. So it should be. Should be this. Yep. I feel like you need to throw the Jinx Bomb out for that to work really good. For what? For like, to like try to do, are you trying to hit me or you just- No, no, this is it. Up? Okay, it's like a mix up kind of thing. Like, oh, I'm gonna get hit. I'm going into it, but I'm canceling out with two shots. I just am not actually doing the further thing. Okay. Cause it's supposed to be, um, And then ideally, I'm like safe. Let's see. <laughs> just, just six P constantly. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, we're used to it. <laughs> the problem is, is going into that, you know, uh, who's who's the other situation? Steve is who I was dealing with in Tekken, where like Lionheart puts me in a can't block. And so it is going into this. What did I change my buttons to? Wait, I thought this was... Okay, now it is. That got changed to sprint? Oh. I don't know how much I like that, but... I just need to remember my inputs. Yeah, I get it. What is... Oh, what is it? Is it half circles for his... For his ult? Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, one is... Uh, so you know your focus move? That gets your focus back, like the... Yeah. Forward circle back. Doubling that does your ultimate one, where you get, like, a lot of focus and, like, lose it very slowly. Um, here, just run at me for a minute. And the other one, I think, is half circle back forward heavy slash, like the heavy hit. Okay. I think. It's either that or just the shoot, but I'm pretty sure it's heavy slash. So give it a shot. Hmm. Weird. It's maybe not heavy slash. Maybe not. I'm trying to. Remember. That was your focus one. Yeah, which is two quarter circle backs punch. Yeah. What I'm a bad habit of is using that, and that move is actually very bad because it changes when I'm close. The knee is super good. But the regular hit is not. I 
Ooh. Yeah, just could not remember. Let me see. Let me bring up a little Happy Chaos. Happy Chaos is somebody I actually wish I was better at playing, but the mastery required to even touch that character in any capacity is insane. Yeah, he's a very high skill for character. And I have a bad habit of picking characters that uh, require skill I don't have. <laughs> Here, I'll hop back in. Did you pull up your little happy chaos flowchart? Flowchart? <laughs> God, I'd be lucky if that motherfucker had a flowchart. He's like Asuka, <laughs> man. He's so... No, I brought up um, apparently the wiki, so... But I already know everything. There's Dust Loop. Thank you. <laughs> now I can play the game. There's what? Dust Loop? Happy Chaos after the nerfs. It's a miracle. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm like a floor four that's masquerading as a floor one. I'm trying to find out what the hell is uh Brother, where is it? Yes, I know his 6P. I just need to remember what his specials are. Danger. Danger. Yeah, it's mostly the... Oh, Deus Ex Machina. There it is. Okay, it's S. It's the green one. Yes. Oh, okay. oh it's Slash. Damn, yeah, I, it's I, slash. I thought it was Punch, but that was the, the focus one. No, yeah, I knew the focus one was Punch. Yeah, Rio is mostly, um, I've been playing Tekken a lot, and I'm just, like, practically new to fighting games. And so I have my, uh, two friends that basically wanted to play Strive, and they are far better than I am. I just played it in the past before. It was mostly about knowing how to do the heavy cancel thing, but I didn't have any focus. Because I know how to do that. <laughs> but Preston, I you remember. This niche thing. Yeah, I, I learned this niche thing right there. That's it. And then cancel it into two so it's better. Yeah, the fighting game uh, community has been awesome so far. Playing everything is su super fun. I, oh, what's the roll? Oh, it's this, but back. Okay. You know what trips yeah, me like, up about it? It's he, backwards, in my opinion. He rolls forwards, but I'm putting a backwards input. But my forwards input is the block in front of me, so I guess I kind of get it. I don't know. <laughs> I always want to press the same button to go into aiming as shooting. Yeah. You main happy cast. If you have any questions, I'm here. Appreciate it. I think the thing I I like the most is that Deus Ex Machina comes from anywhere. Yeah, it's not like range. It's just like, oh hey. Yeah, I love I the know attention. It a good amount. The attention to detail where if you're facing away and then you go into it, he like aims his guns backwards. Oh, it's so cool. Man. Let's see, because, yeah, you have roll. That one I don't love too much because you spend your health to do it. I don't know if you ever noticed that. Yeah. Wow. I mean, it's cool. I just can't use it, you know. <laughs> I'm not capable of. All right, let me remember. I think it's this jumping one is good. Oh, and then you have the down kick, too. What's the dust? I don't like the dust one that much. See, I, in wild. I input a new button. That That is not working. Unless it is. Let me see. Which button? Roman cancel, but instead it's working as the you names. Need, you need bar. Roman cancel oh, I don't have enough? Yeah. Hold on. 
Okay. But it that is weird because it is inputting the uh, the name thing. <laughs> Clone is good because it has hit stop, so you get more time to counter hit. It has hit stop? Yeah. Holy shit. Here. Oh, well. <laughs> Let's just jump in and shoot the gun every single time. Can I command grab that? Uh, try it. I know, not really. Hmm, but it does it stop you from though. moving. Yeah. Wait, pull one out real quick. Mm. I, that stopped me. I didn't stop. Yeah. Because it took my hit. Interesting. I can stand in the clone. Oh, wow. That's the move I love. Like, that one's really good. <laughs> then you get better at managing the focus for it. Ooh, happy chaos. Here, 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 here. Welcome back. Right but... No, no. We were we were talking while you were gone about how I the only thing that I know how to do with that character comparable to the rest of it is going immediately into the focus mode shooting and then canceling it into two bullet reload and not three so that i'm plus and that is it <laughs> mm. i got freaking jammed by one earlier oh hey, that's hey, a, it's a good character pop pop in let me no not that one no i wanted to see you two fight again oh okay oh, okay uh my controller wants to work chips your main guy do you have any other characters that you like he is the only character I play. <laughs> he is quite literally the only character I play. That's nice. No, hold on. I'm curious or something. This is going to be embarrassing, but... Because you asked about Bedman, which made me curious your thoughts on Bedman. Or if um, you were just asking good. because of me. I feel like he's... I was just asking because of you, honestly. But, like, he's a good character. I feel like he's a good character. He's not the strongest because, like, Ty and freaking uh l felt's really strong right now i know uh sin got a buff um giovanna's always gonna be good giovanna's the character i want to understand how to play but at the same time jesus christ my brain hurts yeah yeah giovanna's cool giovanna's real cool her freaking 6p is uh, her 6p is frustrating Oh, god damn it. I wasn't spectating in time. <laughs> I oh, didn't no. realize you guys were in it. Uh... Spectate from the next match. Stupid game. Yeah, even though Swift has not practiced it, um, his Kai Kisk is actually good. And I say this as we're low rank players because when we were like originally got the game and just messing around playing with each other that's the one character he picked up and immediately was able to do things with mm. like before i knew the game i couldn't i couldn't face off if that made sense no no that makes sense Ooh. Get down <laughs> all right yeah, that's my only talking thing i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry no you're good brother hey trippy <laughs> Yeah, just stay in the corner for me. Okay. All right, I will. No, leave me in the corner. That's not the corner. <laughs> well, at least I'll be spectating next time I get in. Yeah. I don't. I can't do his Z. Oh my god, his Z is weird. Oh. Because um, it's, like, it's a D S D like low Z. It's so S D. Yeah, that's yeah, the I'm sorry. dragon that was punch the... input. Yeah, it's, I hate it. I, I'm so bad at Z's. Oh, so, tip for Z's. Mm -hmm. Freaking learned this from uh, a friend of mine. Um, you, you're going to get mad how easy a Z input's going to be. Okay. 
um, you basically hold forward mm-hmm. and then immediately quarter circle. Yeah. And that's your Z input. No. That's yeah. what I was telling you. Like what? Like I'm gonna do it now? That's it. I don't. You don't need to do the actual whole Z movement. That's it. That's it. That is all it is. Hold forward and do quarter circle. And the reason it's fun too is that for certain games like Street Fighter, Dragon Punches are big on being invincible. Um, so you can just hold forward and have the button buffer while you're down on the ground. That's why it's so common in certain games that allow it, where you can just rising <laughs> sure you can and it's annoying yes. as hell and uh, you can get that and that's what i was saying i was like oh, something i gotta learn in this game because people get that off of like i hard knock down them and as soon as i get near them they're already in the air ready for me like they're already doing the z input and i'm like how are they doing it that fast and my friend told me he's like you can buffer and i'm like how do you buffer in this game everything's so freaking fast Thank you for the follow, medieval fellow. Also, Rio, you're so right. Like being a low tier player has been just so fun. Cause my my experience is oh. Did we lose Swift? No, I'm here. What's up? Are you guys playing? Cause yeah, yeah. we're still in here. Okay, it lost connection to you guys for a second, so. I don't know. I just lost connection. Server network. Oh, no. Oh, it's steam maintenance is it time for you. Steam maintenance time? Oh, is it really? Oh, we dealt with this last time. Yeah, valid. <laughs> oh, my that God. Valid. I was like, am I holding block? I think I am. I sure hope I am. Network. I forget that he has shark teeth. Why does he have shark teeth? Bro, do you know Chip's the president of the United States? <laughs> he's the president. He's president. He's the president he the of king. an African country. He made a fucking country and he's like, I'm the president. And nobody's yeah. him. And it's in Africa. Freaking, what's his name? Uh, I said the United States, not the United States. Uh, you're right. Uh, what's his name? The fan guys is, is like his uh, secretary or something. Uh, uh, Anji, Anji. Yeah, Anji. I, every time I fight an Anji on ladder and I'm playing Bridget, I have to go, I know his op- first opening move is going to be spin. Don't press yep. anything. Always. And guess what I do? Always. Guess what I do? I press something. I don't know why I do it. Always, bro. Same here. It's, it gets me every time. It gets me every every fetching time. Dude, it's like Anji has one move and it's spin because it's a good move and he can do whatever the hell he wants out of it. Out of it is so <laughs> hey man we got this move that makes you invulnerable and you can do like a fire emblem side b out of it of high mid or low uh have fun yeah quite hunter why are you invisible i don't know i'm inside of you whoa oh. are you ready biking oh, screw me i have no i've never i bought her i never played her i mean if you like rush down you'd like her yeah, no, I got, I got watch. She's the reason why. I'm, hey, Rio's I'm right. Just bait the spin, man. Dude, I know. I need to just bait the spin, and I can fuck any Anji. But the problem is, Ooh, I get pause. baited. Pause. One of my buttons again. Oh. Yeah, I have no idea how I'm, how I'm playing this character, dude. Well, you're close. I just have to remember my button inputs. It's been. Like probably five months since I've actually played this game in any capacity, and even then I'm floor four. Oh wait, really? Oh yeah, like not joking when I say it's been oh, Tekken. That's the... Oh nice. Yeah, you really haven't touched this since um Street Fighter came out. Yeah, I mean most of it was like I mean you guys play now, but the amount of people that actually played when Guilty Gear was the only fighting game I played was none. I was just like playing it alone. And for me, and it's then, it's playing with people. That's the most fun. I've always been playing. I've been playing this game since it came out. And like a few of y'all picked it up. Well, I, I picked it up real late. So that was the thing. And it was just during uh, a period where nobody was. 
I thought I made, I literally thought I put a button to burst, but I guess not. I don't think you assigned it. Cause I remember seeing psychic for a second. Oh, it's psych. Okay. Then I'm, I'm getting it mixed with dash. That's what I keep pressing yeah. is this. Okay. Cause yeah, yeah instant air dash. Yeah. Okay. Oh, <laughs> yeah? No you don't want to get hit with that? I have no idea what I'm doing, dude. <laughs> what is this? Oh, I was trying to charge it up just to see. Let's see why people play here, though. Vikings are aggressive online. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. No, that's, an, that's an I know, man. <laughs> No, he's the reason why I'm four six right now. Right before I, right before I, as as we were talking about this, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get the good move. Hopped on, no. fought this bike in, and freaking was tossing my salad, and I couldn't do nothing. <laughs> Dude, bike ends on four and five, and then tossing my salad just because it's like. You know who really got me? <laughs> um, the NPC bike in on extreme mode in arcade. I, I just like, oh my god, that's the only character that was so hard for me. I mean, outside of the actual secret bosses, those I couldn't fight for hell. Oh, well, that was a good follow on that low that you did. Freaking yeah, when you only play one character. Old habits die hard, huh? Mm -hmm. I know she has a counter, but I don't remember what it's what, what it is. It's like a it's, really it's quick this. Counter. If you're watching, it's when she throws up her arm like this. Mm. I just forget what it is. It's like a quarter circle input, I think. I think it's, I think it's a back, probably punch, because it's with her hand. Yeah. I think he just did it by accident. I watched a friend play Potemkin for months before I got the game. He inspired me, and I'm glad I picked it up. So did you pick up Potemkin because of the friend? Because they were telling me earlier that uh, Potemkin got some buffs. And I've gotten Potemkin bustered plenty. That, that's the, that's the counter. That move you just did. It missed, but that was it. Yo, that's so fast. I've been getting hit by that, too. That's crazy. Yeah, fair. Oh, after Tatami, I believe you can do that Sword Slash special. I, I've had that happen to me a lot. I can't not remember my specials right now. Oh, because you don't have tension, yeah. Yeah. That explain why I am like, man, I'm really trying to do something, but I can't remember how to do it. I think the thing that inspired me the most to actually get this game legitimately is the art style. The art style just sold me so much. Yeah. Are you ready? Enough of that. <laughs> no. <laughs> Back to chip. Yeah. I'm done experimenting with other, other characters. I just don't remember any combos or nothing. Right, I can't jump against you. You're just going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Carry my ass, huh? Oh, right. I'm a hold character. How did I just remember? I was like, dude, I'm missing half my kit. Where is it at? I forgot. I'm a Guile player. Hey, you didn't you didn't need to do that. Like. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Overheads, man.
You tried yeah, so yeah. hard to, but you need to get better at half circles before I can justify playing him. I can relate. Half circles were difficult. Being a con uh, a keyboard player and then a um, what do you call him? Oh, is this not my dust? No, it is my dust. Okay. Uh, being a keyboard player and then like just leverless now that I got recently has been a lot nicer at like being able to do half circles, but still the difficulty I find is um, what is it? Having to press forward and then the half circle. That's been the thing that's gotten me the most in this game, at least. And of course, I don't remember any of the specials for Axel. Looks like I win this time. I'm very bad at Axel's time stomp, too, because you have to do it again. Sickle Storm is a heavy. Okay. It's two three six oh it's two three six two three six heavy okay Are you ready? oh no switching characters so i was like i'm not, I'm not playing by kim who you playing uh champ <laughs> i'm going back home <laughs> you don't want to play potemkin and try and get some potemkin busters on us no you know your ass condone, good i don't want to condone my friends to that that's just toxic Oh. All right, now we got the zoner gameplay going. Pretty good aura. Kai's pretty good zone, too. My sword is pretty... My sword's range is pretty nuts. Why am I... Yes. <laughs> my first game! <laughs> <laughs> this entire time because <laughs> I remembered buttons also that canceling your um your your fucking spear thing is amazing yeah, yeah that's like really fucking annoying that Jesus Christ <laughs> you picked up Nago and Biken instead how do you feel about Nago do you uh Nago is really strong yeah, do you do you like Nago's like blood management system? I need to learn the other sickle storm. Oh, that's not the jump one I thought it was. That is. Oh. You got me. Oh. Never mind. Hits twice. Yeah, I learned. What? Oh my god, that's the one that goes through block. Uh, do you have to faultless it? I think you do. I think you do, yeah. Well. <laughs> Try to see how fast I can get out. It's got to ramp up. Yeah, it's got to ramp up for sure. Not fast enough. My sword just mm -hmm. went through your leg during that. Eye frames, baby. Eye frames. Oh, oh nice. I did not know Axel could do that. Do what? You like... That was a fine balance. You like, you hit through his projectile and then hit him. Yeah, because yeah. he canceled that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's, mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Hey, the only reason I like zoners is because if my ass is in the corner from playing bad, it's okay. Yeah, you're still no. good. God damn it! Oh. I didn't oh. Sorry. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> we just fucking ripped it. We're like, yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Don't worry, this match will be over fast. Oh, I'm sure. 
Yeah, he's really fun. The bludge management was tough at first, but I've gotten better at landing BSU to mitigate it. Uh, do you guys know what BSU is? No. BSU? For Nago. I think, for Nago, I think that's one of his moves where he wastes the blood. That's like the really big, the really big sword slash, I think. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I find I find it really cool that like Nago is essentially this boss character that does function strength wise as a boss character, but you do have to properly play him. Uh, and I am not close. I do think the teleportation that he does is very cool. Yeah, because he doesn't have an actual run. Yeah, I am um, a bit biased because I'm only one achievement away from perfecting this game and it's without dying fighting all nine bosses in arcade mode and the secret boss like Nagoriyuki is insane and it's very difficult for me I think like every three months I'll attempt it again and then not work and that's where me playing soul happened because I was like mm. all right let me play with the brain not okay brain dead mean but like the straightforward main character, you know, do mm. the classic flow chart can. And I mean, it didn't work out because I didn't know how to like capitalize on the damage, but. Oh, no. no, 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 no. I'm going to. That's probably my last one. I got to head out of here. All right. Oh, Blood sucking oh, universe command grab that bites and satiates blood rage. I'm familiar with oh, it. Okay. Yep. Okay, That's okay. a command grab though. That's crazy. Jamie in Street Fighter Six has this command grab where you like flick him in the head and stop them. And I it's so difficult to me because it's I believe a half circle input. And it's very short. So you're doing this command grab that stop them and then you need to follow it up with whatever you need to do and just the the mashing involved to throw out that half circle and then be guaranteed that you have a follow-up to it is nuts Woo. yep He's too good at that. Oof. Bad habit. What's a bad habit on you? Uh, not finishing my combo I have in mind. I keep like halfway finishing it and then like, what am I doing? And then I forget. Mm, yeah. Uh, you gotta be more present when you're like playing. That's something Sorry, that's switch. easier once you uh, learn the characters, which is nice, but I didn't double hit that either. Nice jump. Could instant it, but nothing after that. I, uh, <laughs> that doesn't feel good. <laughs> I'm like, damn, I feel like I'm just bullying kids. Like, not, not, no jabs at y'all. No, but I mean, that's what it is, right? Yeah. yeah. You're still on that platform. <laughs> damn. Okay. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last one, then I'm gone. Last one. Mm. Yeah, and I have not looked up or even seen anything for Elfelt other than, like, what her command list is. I mean, like, yeah, of course, everybody's 6P is good. Mm -hmm. Hers is really good, though. She's got that move that I question how good is. Because it feels nice, but it feels like it leaves me open very easily. 
It it does. It it's like Kai has that dash, that low that low dash. Giovanna has it. Sin has it. When they're just dashing, they're open. But you have to be you have to know when they do it though, because you can get caught trying to catch it, and you can get caught doing it. Oh shit. Huh. Yeah, Chip's pretty. Chip, I understand why he has a low health pool. <laughs> he needs it. He's so yeah. impressive in combo, but you need to break his combo and combo him back. Or pretend to grab him. Or pretend to grab him. Because you get to like stuff like this, and I'm like, oh. Yeah, I, yeah, I understand. Like, I can't be mad because I have a low, a, a low health pool. Okay, see, see, like I tried to grab, I tried to get you out of it, and I got hit by it. Cause your wreck, that wreck can be up, it could be high, mid, or low, right? Yeah, I choose. Does it always start high though? Yep. Yeah. Which is the difficulty the of it, because you could just kill it with a six P. Let's see. That's why I was getting hit by it. Like, I'll keep doing it. Ah, eh, well. Well, yeah. That's why but I was yeah. getting hit. Because I always, I always block regular, and I'm like, why am I getting hit by this? And I can just continue. It won't end if I just keep doing the same overhead. But then I have the low. And then I can, you know, go in anything else. Like, the heavy out of it is good for knockback, but... Oh, I can't wait for you. Like, this always gets me. That's why I jumped. So I'm like, hopefully, yeah. So I'm yeah. like, I really hope I don't get hit by that thing. It's so big, and it's still almost caught you. Yeah. I can't wait for y'all to get better. And you start hitting me with the red RCs mid combo. I'm gonna be sitting there being like, oh, this is sick. I can't wait for yeah. that. I've wanted to actually pull off where if I have double bar on Bridget, do her like one where she summons the teddy bear and combos, mm. red RC out of it and then combo with the bear better. Mm. But I I never have double bar and I almost never actually get a chance to use the bear. Like, yeah, the bear the bear's very niche. The bears, well, I mean, mm. the bears are good if you can pin him on a wall and use it because yeah, I was gonna say. Hands. I also feel that like you don't sure. do the dive bomb as often as you could. Cause that leaves you open, I think. Yeah. You can cancel it and move. Mm. I did the wrong move. All right, what's, gentlemen. What's Elfeld's best pleasure. aerial? Yeah, no, take care. Thank you for joining. It was fun. Thank you, thank you. Are there dust? Yeah. That's so funny. That's why it multi hits. Okay, so it does hit through, and I trade with that. Well, let's see. Well, like, I like the heavy slash, because I don't know many other options to do. Yeah. And you get, like, a free follow-up, and of course it's a heavy, so it does, like, a good amount of damage. Doesn't mean that it's good, though. Ooh, so the Rekka doesn't turn if you go under me. Mm -mm. That's a shame. Aw. Oh. The gun move takes so long to come out. Mm-hmm. Challenge me again whenever you like. Where's Soulless Bad Guy? Let's see if I remember any of his moves.
I have a love-hate relationship with being able to queue up as, um, like, whatever character you want to play. Because mm -hmm. it's nice to be able to look and say, oh, cool, let's, you know, play against Akai as, like, a soul, for example. But at the same time, can you allow me to run it back but choose my character in the running it back? Yeah, I wish if I put it on, like, uh, what do you call it? Um, rematch mode, like, that let you change your character, but it doesn't. Let's see, I have Fireball. I got the double kick, because I have to press it again. Wait, why did I move forward then there's one that moves you forward i think i thought it was course to go forward but then no. just living off a lot of like the heavy punches oh yeah we got to get with the classic i forgot <laughs> oh six p <laughs> no not even the fucking six uh six what is that what is the green one i don't even think it's six it's just no button this was just so fucking funny to me it's so good now uh, six b is the other hand that's the move i want to know can i come back down or no i think it's I think just so. up is it no i think you can do up and then down hmm I think we. I thought he did. Don't know. I'm probably thinking of other games like uh, Cloud from Smash. Yeah. Yeah, close slash. <laughs> just... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get him. Ooh. <laughs> oh my He'll never guess the mix up. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, fair. Oh, it doesn't beat it. <laughs> fair enough. That basically almost got me. That worked. That's yeah, crazy. That's, work. that's crazy. I don't remember how I do the dragon install fucking. Like his like big grab. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely quarter circle. I don't think it's a. I think it's quarter circle back. Uh, not quarter circle back. It's like half circle. Oh back yeah, that move. Forward and then. Okay, are we back to this? <laughs> Not on purpose. <laughs> it's, it's just one of the only effective things I have. I gotta learn how to spend my gauge. Challenge me again whenever you like. Burst or tension? Both. <laughs> uh, fair. Burst, uh, like it's so it's so bad. It's like burst is like such a risky thing to burn your half of it to either do the defensive one or like the dash in, but it's so rewarding if you do. Uh, but then like oh man, I'll never be able to burst. Like I won't have enough for psychic burst.
You dare challenge me on my name? Yeah. I only remember uh, the specials. I don't remember anything else. Okay, do you want me to like go through it with you? <laughs> no, it's fine. Okay. <laughs> yeah, see that. Oh, I jumped way too high for that. That's the double kick that if you do that in the air going in, but the roll is really good. Wow, that reached me. And you think I would know the range? Yeah, unfortunately. Oh, that dust didn't hit? Or did you hit me uh, first? I think I clashed the dust and kept going with it. Okay. I mean, I shouldn't have done a dust in any scenario anyway, so it's just kind of like throwing out and saw what worked. That move is so good. Oh, like, yeah. My favorite's actually, um, Crouching heavy slash for the anti air because it just it's so wide. Yeah, I've noticed. Uh, I think when I was originally looking it up, like a lot of combos use it too, just as a like filler extension for it. Yeah, because it's got good reach and does really good damage. Oh, it's. Oh. I think I think my steam just went down. <laughs> yep, it did. Yeah. Welcome to Steam. Um. Steam servers where we take them down randomly. <laughs> I was pressing the wrong button to be able to do the little Ryzen spin. Which one's the Ryzen spin? Oh, like where, where you like spin towards me? Yeah. Towards so me. Yo -yo. once I did it at yeah. the end, I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, I get it confused sometimes. The one thing I've been trying to get better at is, you know, when she rides the yo-yo, kind of like a scooter. Yeah. Um, is intentionally using the either like not um starship but like where she jumps up and spins the yo-yos around her one or the like oh i'm gonna just like skid low you and the problem oh, is the i use a random yeah which yeah. it's a good low hit because it trips like if i could do that into like a roman cancel it'd be great but you have to do it with intention and then learn yeah intention it's and with it's... intention and also like catching somebody but it's I'm so bad. And it's hard in a game that's a bit more faster paced. So you have to like figure out how to break it down for yourself. Mm -hmm. I will be right back. Yeah, go for it. Is it still preparing network, huh? Hmm. Due to not being connected. Let me try and close it. Actually, could I just reconnect? Do I have to reopen the game? I am not sure. Still preparing network, so probably. Might be down again. I'm not not really aware. Yeah, dude, not being connected. Okay. Nope. I had to figure out what button it made for me to quit. Because it's with a different controller. Maybe I change the display features to not keyboard, but change to controller. I don't love it, but that might be the easiest thing for me to understand what it wants me to press and where. All right. 
settings. Huh? Select. Select was H, I suppose. All right, still out of sync. Mm hmm. Now we're just waiting. Wait till the game allows us to play again. But hey, still back on that conversation of the uh, controller. I really like it. It's nice having something that doesn't like hurt too much to play, like my uh, keyboard did. But I don't have any problem with the keyboard. I think it's just mostly that I could hit the other keys. And sure, I could have just gotten a keyboard, removed the keys, still played, but. I don't know. If you're going to go through the effort and everything, might as well get something you're, like, enjoying. I think playing this is fun, and I th do think that helps. It's the more enjoyable of an experience it is, then obviously the more fun I'm having and the more I would play. Steam Cloud out of date. I guess we just wait for the friends list, huh? Damn, Steam does this all the time, and I never realized because I just normally would play games that don't connect to the Steam servers. That's funny. I'm back, and Steam servers are still being Steam servers. It's so fun. Same for me. Mm -hmm. Did you see the um, teaser picture for the new character for Strive and everyone like kind of guessing who it's going to be? Yeah, there's a lot of copium back and forth, everything. Do you have a character that you would like to see? I don't know Strive well enough, so I'm just going to go with Dizzy, even though I know it's not going to be Dizzy. Yeah, I, know it would make, I mean, like Alisan happy as shit. Yeah, it's hard because I'm obviously biased. I prefer girl characters. Though I don't. I just really don't assume it will be because yeah. the most popular ones that people are saying are Zappa, Venom. I mean, there's there's Abba and uh, Slayer that people want as well. I saw a lot of Abba or Abba, ABA. Yeah, yeah Abba, because it's off of the so, band. Mm -hmm. I mean, in terms of voted, it's Slayer and Abba are the two highest ones. It just depends on the regions because they have these different like surveys that have gone out and they've mm -hmm. posted first, second, and third. And it's literally back and forth between like those two. I do remember seeing a joking one of like, hey, guys, I know it doesn't fit the thing, but I put Robokai in it anyway. And I went, that's funny. People really want them. I'm a bit biased, though, because. I don't it's not that I don't like joke characters. I think I don't like that he's Kai. And I'm saying this is like. Not invested and not a fan of the game they're from, like just as an observer that even though they are a separate character entirely and how they play and everything, I'm just looking like, ah, it's like receiving Daisy as a, you know, Unique clone character. character. Yeah. And they don't do anything different, even though they do. It's like, I still visually see you as Kai. So mm -hmm. it's, it's hard for me to like care. <laughs> yeah. I like that as a joke though. I was like, because it was just set up just like poorly too. like it doesn't fit. But here it is anyway. There's the um, doctor woman with like a syringe. I forget her name. Oh, I know what you're talking about. 
it, there's a lot that just as long as the character is cool would be nice i just uh design wise don't care for most of the uh men that are high voted that people like i mean mm -hmm. slayer i don't like visually but he does have a pile bunker and that is cool so but again he doesn't visually have a pile bunker his move just is a pile bunker mm -hmm. man these servers are still down huh yeah i hate that we just play so many other games that connect to external servers that we never have to deal with it yeah thanks final fantasy weird man it'd be nice if i could get that final achievement for this game though but god is it fucking hard time to time to grind i don't know seeing a lot of uh people online are just really admitting that it's like luck Zappa makes no sense. He got his curse cured. Unless he's completely different. It's probably just uh Abba. If it's Abba, that's cool. Because um I hope they make her look better. Yeah, she looked weird from like the pictures I saw. And what was she, what was the last game was she at? Was it was she in Zerd or no? I believe she was in Zerd. I know. Strive is my first Guilty Gear game, and I watched a lot of lore videos, and I got confused and stopped watching them. Oh. I somehow, I somehow understood the lore of Kingdom Hearts better. Only there it is. Uh, not made. installed. I was going to open it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm... Um, she was a wild character. She has her key... Uh, she kind of has the big, like, blood theme. You played Accent Core and strip, skipped straight to Strive. Yeah, for, for me, like, Zerd was the first one I played, but I didn't play play it. Like, I liked Elfelt, which is why it kind of sucks that she's not the same now, even remotely in terms of, like, gameplay. Um... But I just like mash buttons and didn't have friends that played it. You know, I kind of treated it almost like a single player game because that's kind of how they were back in the day. Uh, and then didn't touch them. I've always just from far away appreciated anime fighters, basically, where it's like, oh, OK, watch the tournament for Blast Blue. Don't really know what's going on, but just like appreciate the fact that people are able to like put in that work. Like, Blasblue was cool to see. Guilty Gear was cool to see. What was another one? Grand Blue. Grand Blue's another game. Like, have you touched the newest Grand Blue at all, Swift? No, I've never touched a Grand Blue game, but I know that they're dope. Like... The new one that came out, it's free. Oh, is it? It's a free-to-play game that uh, plays a bit like League of Legends, where it has a, like, weekly rotation of like three characters i think it is that are free okay and so i don't recall if you can buy them with it but the primary selling point is that the grand blue fighting games are kind of like the original modern street fighter because you have one button input specials okay but they go in a cooldown and if you do the actual input it goes on less of a cooldown and does more damage. Interesting. And that's like so a primary feature. How to play. Yeah, but like, but like if you just like want to press the special, you can, and they go on a cooldown, and you like see the cooldown. That's cool. I Didn't they just add like 2B to that? I think I've seen some clips. Yes. I think 2B is like the newest spider, and one of her specials is literally like her pulling her chip and it blowing up. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot of like cool character designs. I think it's I don't I don't know if I would say like it's it's varied enough for us. Also, when the fuck is Steam gonna come back? Grand Blue's specials and combos are pretty sick. Yeah. Every character looks cool too. 
and I mean, I'm speaking as a guy that likes to play a lot of girl characters. There's not really a girl you wouldn't like to play. I um so similar because we're talking about Grand Blue. I started playing Relink a little while ago. That's the new it's RPG, actually, right? Yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's I've heard it's good, but I've never never touched it. It's so it's really fun because like you get to do combos and stuff almost kind of like a fighting game with like specials that have cooldowns, but it feels kind of like Monster Hunter and Link game because like you just fight bosses. And there are some really satisfying like moments that I've had with it. It's it's a ball. That's tight. All right, my game booted up. Let's see if it lets me go online now. I'm still disconnected. I'm looking at it and I'm sad. I hit play and then it just went ahead and said that I was up to date. So we'll see. Mm. It might have lied. I still might not be, but worth a try. Yeah, I think I think Grand Blue is kind of funny in the sense that if I was to play the game, I would get stuck. Oh. This is me being very open. But I would play based on originally who attracts me the most, because that is unfortunately <laughs> the person that I am typically. And the reason Grand Blue makes it difficult because every girl is pretty fucking great. <laughs> and so I yeah. think the primary thing is that I would get stuck being like, how do you play at the highest level? Because I, you know, I would need to make my decision from that or something. I... Yeah, I still wasn't able to go online. How do you play this girl, though? Elfeld? I mean, yeah. So, a fun thing that I, when I was messing around in training mode that I realized... The mere existence of Ladiba makes Grand Blue so much cooler. Honestly. I'm pretty sure... Ladiva's the uh, one with the beard, right? I'm bad at names. Yes. Yeah, Lidiva. Okay. You've ever seen that Swift? Yeah, I'm looking right now. Yeah. I I had to remember that that, that was their name cuz I'm not like a grand blue person. I've just like from afar been aware. Mm -hmm. You were saying though about Elfelt, sorry? Oh, uh, so you know like where she like shoots her gun uh like a, her quarter circle forward slash heavy slashes or whatever? Yeah. Like with them. If you're too close to them, like just get right up on Axel. Um, and you do it, it'll go behind them and then shoot back. And it's kind of fun. And it's like, I don't know how to combo this, but I know that there's like something fun you can do with that, you know? Hmm. I don't know why I found it very amusing to do, but I think, I mean, most of Elfeld stuff is like her bread and butter, like, um, like oh. infinite combo. That move is wild. That can't be good. That has to be super slow. Yeah, I don't think it's super safe. Is that down heavy? Down green. Slash, okay. Slash. Oh, right. The, the fucking letters and stuff are up there. Okay. Yeah, I just, I don't recognize them by move. I have to think about it. I recognize them by color because I made it my colors. Mm -hmm. Um... Yeah, I think most of her thing comes from doing her, yeah, uh, that combo, the quarter circle back Danger. slash Danger. combo, and then comboing into kick, punch, and then uh, slash and keep doing that until you get them cornered and then heavy slashing for the finisher. Oh, the, but, the heavy slash on it, yeah. Yeah, because, because like, oh yeah, you keep doing it, but you, you do, the heavy slash just ends the combo, but like if you keep doing like the... Uh, slash input in between other stuff you get to go infinite out yeah i was just trying to break the wall i wanted to see how much damage it did with it but get him yeah it's gonna be hard see i think he's gonna need to be like comboed a little bit and then into it there we go there. okay 
That's a decent amount without really being able to see his health. Yeah, I know. I wish I could like freely move them around like they were HUD elements, but I am uh, spoiled. Arc Systems might still be my third most listened to on YouTube music this year again. Oh my god, dude, I've been listening to it like every day just because it's such a bop. My favorite was Let's looking at the see. lyrics to Elfelt's song and like when it gets to like where the girl and like the scream, like the screamo girl are singing at the same time and what they're saying, it's literally just rub, rub a dub. And I'm like, really? That That's the <laughs> lyric we're saying? Why? <laughs> it's so dumb, but I love it. All right, let's see. Dust Sleep, you gave me a two kick into two dust. Into two one four heavy. Uh oh. They gave me an option. They gave me an option? Oh, uh, two, three, six. Oh, because it's my jump, because I can just do the gun. Yeah. Wait, but that's my. I finish with that? Oh, Let's see. So it's. Wow. That's it? I think you. Oh. No, no, I didn't. I didn't do the full thing. Around. Don't worry. Yeah, no, but even after like the, because what it starts low jab or whatever or low slap, yeah, low kick into that. Low kick into low dust, into that jump, to... and then a gun, and it's my choice of the gun. Hello, Kit. I'm really How are you? He doesn't want you to Roman cancel into the um, the grenade drop. Cause it seems like he has like recovery frames during it. He's not getting hit by the grenade. It's just. Tell me what you want me to press. Because I'm trying to figure out what you mean. Because so, I am unfamiliar. Your first two things of like the two, two kick into two dust are fine, but I don't know the input for like that grenade, like jump throw. Oh, it is a quarter circle back heavy slash. Okay, yeah. I, I, I'm surprised that it doesn't want you to do. Um, Two kick, two dust, Roman cancel, quarter scroll back, heavy slash into gun, because I think you'd hit the grenade then. Well, there's a difference do... between combos and Roman cancel combos, right? I know, but I'm just surprised. Well, a Roman cancel combo would only work if you have tension, right? So you'd still need something. Yeah. If you don't. You can also do uh, just regular standing kick. Oh, it's really? But you do still have to do the sweep. And I think it's to give you time to jump. Oh, wait, that's weird. Unless they're just doing that just so you get in the air to get like the really wonky angled um, uh, gunshot. Possible that I'm uh, just not fast enough. Yeah, I was just not fast enough because right there at the grenade hit. Oh, yeah. Okay. Max combo damage said 106. Up on the top of the screen. Yeah, I see that. I'm just like. Oh, okay, it's hard to see the health. Okay, well, I mean. So there's close slash. Right, because I got to remember there's far and close is the thing in this okay. game, just like how there's while standing in Tekken. Can we get online yet or is Steam still down? <laughs> Steam is still fucking down. Uh, how is your day, Kit? Down heavy. Oh, I do want a combo that uses that, but it's close slash. Nope, not that. Oh, it starts the Rekka. Into kick. Into two, one, four, kick. You want me to cancel my Rekka? Wait, am I reading that right?
That's so weird. Huh. I don't know if I'm doing that one right at all. I mean, I was online things and you could check like actually saved combos to check because it tell you if you're doing it right or not. Yeah. Two one four S starts that into five kick. Which is that. Into two one four heavy. Whiff. They want you to whiff? Into jumping heavy. Oh. Really? So is that good for Oki or is that just part of it? Let's see. I completely did the previous combo. That's so funny. And then I got to do that again. So you want me to whiff it, but then do jumping heavy. Is that coming out? I don't think it is. I'm all right for what I can be. How about you? Same. <laughs> Same, sweetheart. I feel you. Nothing's uh, happening. All you're doing is the green job. Now, that might be because I'm doing it from Rekka. Because let's see. How, how do I stop the Rekka into a different input? Um, I mean, am I just waiting? No, because that, that's not optimal. You're going to lose frames. That's what I thought. Um, can you cancel the Reco without, like, doing the heavy? I don't know. I know, I'm looking. <laughs> I have to pull up the character so I can actually look at the command list and, like, try to see if there's something I'm missing. Steam, I am still disconnected. Uh, I'm actually connected now. <laughs> oh, really? Well, let me check again. Yeah. Uh, command list. How do they want you to finish the Rekka? Was it just literally like quarter circle back K into something else? Quarter circle back slash to start the Rekka. 5K. And then um, for one of them, it was quarter circle back kick, which is the gun, like shoot the gun and then you move forward. Yeah. Little dashy gun thing. Let's try and just. Maybe I reopened Steam. You said you're connected. Yeah, I didn't have to do anything. It just connected. But like sometimes it's just like really annoying. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 And then bubble bath. That's what you were saying earlier. Yeah, where it's just rub a dub. Rub a dub. It's so funny. Okay. Now I'm online. I just had to reopen Steam. Super cool. It's like getting red text Warframe updates. <laughs> I still remember back when they were really like, hey, we're doing an update right now. If you're in a mission, stay in the mission. <laughs> I remember seeing that. And having to like really Chill. try it. Well, like live like there were certain periods of Warframe's era where I was like not as strong. And I'm just sitting there like, 
oh god okay guys we gotta bunker down for a good another five to ten fucking minutes and hope to live i've got a room up you made it to floor seven of the tower got disconnected mid-match relaunching them back down to floor six Oof. Oof. at least the only thing that you get to keep is the experience to do it again smile Honestly, good morning. <laughs> yeah i mean he got there now you get the opportunity to do it again now you can say you've got to seven twenties network net worth zero dollars do you have a room up yeah it's the same code as last time cool pasting worked <laughs> <laughs> I hit B. Dip toe into seven, dives out of seven. Ah, uh, that'd be me. Actually, that was me on Tekken earlier. I got to yellow, and then I just, like, lost three matches. Now, granted, I did decide to get to a rank, which bumped up all my other characters, and then I did hop on Reyna, having no experience of her other than, what, two minutes on training? So that is maybe my fault, but. What do you think about plan? Probably L felt because I don't know. She's wacky enough with the specials that you kind of get away with just doing specials for the most part, uh, which yeah. is not the best way to play because I'm not learning anything. But. I mean, I'm I'm looking right now, right? Like I have dust loop open on my phone, and you're telling me five dust or a two dust starter, right? Let me go ahead and read one. Jump kick, jump punch, jump cancel, jump heavy, jump slash, jump heavy, jump cancel, jump heavy, jump heavy, finishing blow. I didn't like any of those words you just said in a row. How can I combo with so many jumps? Is this character crazy on jumps and I didn't know? I don't think so. I don't see a lot of like air elf. Brother, she had rifles and grenades in the other game. <laughs> How'd that start for you? Like, is that a. I mean, I, I understand, but combos into that? That's crazy. I don't know. In the other game, she took you to the wall and shot you to death. <laughs> Amen. And I loved her for it. No, I'm over here now. Now I'm over here. Wow. Yeah, you like that? Actually, I jumped. That would have caught you if I jumped. It counts. It counts. Yeah, it know. counts. It I was counts. It counts. Catch you. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what what else is the better option out of that. So that's my dash button. I don't know if I like that. I wonder, I want to know what my best, like, jump move is. What's the one I should default to, you know? Because I like that one, the heavy, but... I also feel like jump slash is pretty good, too. Ooh, nice. You got me with the low. Man, you're glad I'm not sick of the disaster of passion again. 
fucking love this song until it's like the fifth time played. I thought I changed it. Oh, it goes it... back for some reason. Does it change per character? It's like every time you go back into a room, it like resets stuff. I don't know why. I don't know what broke my guard there. I don't remember what, what button is. It's that one. Okay. That's why I hate that move. Yeah, it's so hard. To that was a fine ballot. Do I have a button for faultless? Don't think so. You can check here. You can go into game settings and stuff. First off, let's see. Faultless. Left trigger. Oh, wait. You can edit room settings, I think? Hmm. Psych burst. Left button. Let's try that. Just so they remember to press these buttons. Oh, right. Change music. Disaster of passion. I just been putting on a random lately or whatever I'm in the mood for. I normally like playing of the character that I am playing. I will say, oh my god, it's Zerd, but one of my favorite fucking songs of the franchise is Marionette. I don't think I've heard it. I'll have to look it up. It is Elfelt's theme, which... From Zerd? Yeah, I don't prefer it because it's Elfelt's theme. It is just a fantastic track. And then that should not work because I don't have tension. Okay. And then that's burst. Cool. Bit of a waste, but <laughs> gotta make sure it works. Ooh, ooh, just get in there. It's like trying to learn everything that does and doesn't hit. Cause that's that's the one thing when I do this, I'm like really curious and what's the good Oh my god. Wait. <laughs> Did you see? I tried it. Block. I didn't think you could dash. Oh, I, like I tried it, but I didn't think you could. Wait, that... I don't know if that changes anything, but I like it. Nice dodge. That's not... <laughs> oh my god, this is so much more annoying now. <laughs> it's fantastic. No. <laughs> no. I can't. Oh. Uh oh. Bye. It worked. I was holding my breath. I did not want to talk shit and then immediately die. I need to get better at the you coming in from low. I don't know if it's just too much Tekken <laughs> where you let the low happen. Hey, 
to that. Whoa, all the way to the edge. Which I also, sorry, Medieval, I did just notice the jump heavy. Okay. But jump slash is great for cross ups. Okay, so it's like kind of what I was noticing. That's cool. I will say, jump dust is uh, cute. It's adorable. I. You tried. No, I did the wrong button. You know where I threw out the uh, rock and roll? Mm -hmm. I wanted to grab. Oh. Would that have worked at least? I don't know. I don't know if it would have caught me. With my luck, it would have. Mankind. Okay. Duel one. Let's rock. God damn. God, that move is so cool. Nice empty jump. Oh, just jumping the jump. <laughs> Oh shit! I don't know why I thought that was gonna give me, like, me a little bit more time. Jump dust is great too. It hits on both sides and stalls. Yeah, it does stall in the air. That's a good point. Like I am slower. Oh my god. Yeah, you better get good at your uh, dragon punch. You don't have to block, so you can press forward. Cause I'm in the air. There you fucking go. I don't know why I did that. I, that was such a dumb fucking move. Huh? Huh? I even did it twice to see, like, when were you free? Yeah. Okay. If it wasn't for the fact that I was broken, I did get you with a 6P in there, and I did nothing with it. I absolutely just sat there like, oh, that worked. Yeah, you stuffed the hell out of me and just went, oh, it worked. <laughs> Anyways. He stunned himself with his own creativity. Let's hit him up with the Tekken combos. Up, oh, back three. I wonder how good that one is. Ooh! Still like the visuals of that move. Understood. Have a day. It works. No I don't like to talk about the slash was way. still inside of you. Like, come on. I didn't think that would work, but I was like, there's only one way to find out. That's insane. Oh, you're fucked. I don't have to deal with faultless anymore, which is my biggest flaw. Oh, my good Lord. All right, right now, for the past two minutes, you've been playing a different game than me. could have gone for low, but I needed a lot of damage to catch up on, so I was desperate. Speaking of damage, huh? Oh 
my god. What? Where'd my grab go? fucking way wait I'm until you got too confident no. i thought i'd hit you with you were the like dash uh in. i'm schmoovin god that has so much like iframes on it it's so annoying i've obtained a new have... badge oh yeah no it popped up and told me i have obtained a new badge so i think that counted our no it, it hit the max replays. It's best to two. Oh, I'm sorry, first to two. Are you ready? I thought that meant it was saving replays. No. Oh, wow, it I've does... never read. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's hard. I get it. What do I. What's up? I'm trying to think of like how do I want to start, but like I've noticed you back up a lot. Like I, you let me be the aggressor at the beginning, which has not worked for me, as you can see clearly right now in our positioning. Oh fuck! I was really betting on it coming back around. Wait, is the green one stronger? Oh, just can't beat out no matter what, okay. Oh, I wanted it to come back around. It would have. Back to floor seven, you just beat up a brand new level one bedroom here to do it. Congrats, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want me to play Axel, I'm playing Axel. Yeah, you really fucking are right now, huh? Uh, the worst part is that you are the person that like the angrier you get, the better you get. <laughs> nice. No. No. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> I got two, baby. I outplayed you. I bursted it. Uh uh. Uh, I bursted you first. Yeah, I don't know why I keep trying to grab first when I know it's not gonna grab you. Oh. I gotta figure out what like the a good thing to lead into like what are my options when I flip over. Yeah. Just the game plan in which you play this game is so drastically different than the experience of me playing like Tekken, which is crazy. <laughs> Let's just keep doing the same thing. How 
did that not hit me? I don't know. I've tried to use it like so many times and it just doesn't work out. I don't think you did an input. I think you're still blocking. Yeah. Ooh, my foot was so close. Well, it really was. Oh, I keep Wow, yours hits first. I've learned. I remembered where the button on my controller was. <laughs> I want to know what a good follow up after that is. Maybe it's just immediately doing a Rekka. Kinda. Just not confirmed. Ooh, nice. Ah, oh, fuck. Why is my grab? I. Okay. Show me. Show me. Overview. What is up with this fucking grab special? What is it good for? You have to be, like, touching them. Like, it's so close for no reason. And I have a move that says touch you. <laughs> bomb. Oh, my God. I cannot say that. Bomb, bomb, near. Let me see the hitbox on it. Oh. Rainy. Okay. So she throws out her hands like she's kind of tripping, right? Yeah. It's from the tip of the finger of her uh, hands being outstretched to her own body. You have to so be like in a hug. hug. Yeah, it's not even touching the bombs that she visually has. Yeah, because that would only, you know, make sense. Yeah, command grab, setting up a boosted mix-up or as a combo confirm. However, almost never worth the high cost. Yeah, because it's so risky and it seems like never have. This cannot be teched out with a throw clash, making it a counter to fuzzy throw tech. By resetting into a mix-up, you gain higher damage potential than comboing directly from the grab. Unfortunately, the damage remains low for the cost, even if the mix-up works. Struggling to match that of throw into a fast roaming cancel, despite being significantly riskier. Oh, network error. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Weird. Network. Um, despite being much more expensive. Oh, I'm never going to try for this ability. I just read a line that I don't like to hear. What was that? <clears throat> Combined with other problems, like being vulnerable to psych burst before the explosion even goes off. You could just burst off of it? Yeah. Nah. I'm good. Yeah, you good, bro. Sounds like I will uh, not. <laughs> Just I, I just won't use it then, I guess. I mean, it said that it was like a good idea as a um, counter to certain backdashes, but it's... fuck me if I'm trying that, I guess.
trying to do that instead of uh the down because it looks like my leg goes further I feel like way me Yep, yep, yep. It's like playing Axel all over again. How did that not hit you, what? Thank you. Oh, shit. Damn, I tried. You really did. Oh, nice job. That is very good. Yeah. Oh. I'm a little sad that that didn't hit you. I'm like, just taking the second to see what my options are. I'm not really sure. Like when it's coming at me, you know? Yeah. Uh, and of course, I was up in the air, so I didn't get to see you coming at me. Oof. A fast one sure comes out fast. It really does. That was a fine the problem with the fast one is that yours will break mine versus like my heavy that just goes through everything. Yeah, it also helps that I'm like very long gun. Yeah. I thought I, I thought I hate you for a second the way that your character reacted. Oh, uh, this. Yeah. Okay, that moves so yeah, it was the one that constantly got you when when I first played Elf Hell. I'm trying different stuff, you can tell. Ooh, nice. Okay, I disagree with that one. Let's see. You caught me in an animation. So it freezes I was, time, huh? Yeah, and I was literally starting. Um, what do you call it? Lightning rush or whatever. Ride the lightning. My reactions are good. That's something I discovered when I was playing Tekken. Is that like the idea of what I should be doing is what I have to learn. So if you're telling I could just respond when I start to see you do something, that would that'd be good for me. Yeah. I'm trying to see if I can like combo that, you know. So I will say I did notice um, it slams you down in the ground, like if you're jumping yeah. up. Yeah, it catches you. Like and then I, I was able to do that into the Rekka if I was ready. So that's huge. <laughs> no, that was my fault. I, I fucking knew you would do it, and I still went. Yeah, I'm going to do my high jump attack, huh? <laughs> 
By the time I hear the little like slide whistle, I know it's too late. I know I've been caught. Oh, it's like playing fucking Peacock and Skullgirls. Nice job. I keep just not doing anything for that. Did that count as something that I could follow up on? Because I didn't think so. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I literally like went through your titty. Like, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh, well, you're ready for that one, huh? Were you trying to grab or trying to do that? No, I was trying to dust. Okay. Oh, let's try. Oh, nope, that didn't work. I did the wrong input. <laughs> uh, anyone could see from a mile away what I was trying to do. And what else would, would I have done? I literally didn't put thought into that as the problem. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get better on Kai of doing mm -hmm. that, of hitting, like, oh, I hit one of my ranged, follow it up with, like, the super ranged, whatever it's called. What's it called? Hey, heads up, I'm picking Axel. I hate you, but okay. I do feel like I'm already immediately a better elf elf than I am any other character I've played. Maybe, I don't know. When we started playing, I feel like I was a better Bridget. Yeah. Because I sat down and like tried to learn a combo and I learned um, a quarter of a bread and butter and that was my bread and butter. So. Aha, uh -huh, I can do a fourth of this. <laughs> yeah, I have the butt end of the bread. No butter. Mm -mm -mm -mm. all right let's see what my chargings are i gotta get the timing right oh please don't disconnect it from the network what the, what fuck? the fuck where did i get disconnected oh it's a network error that's what's yeah. up for me what a wacky ass game only because i looked at the time how much more do you want to play up to you I took, I, well. I took a nap. I took a nap before. So. Valid. Mm. <laughs> my food hasn't been picked up yet, so probably when I pick up my food, I'll be like, hey, I gotta eat. I am down with that. I mean, right now, hanging out, just enjoying time with everybody. Right. I'm disconnected from Steam right now for some reason, so what? I'm gonna fill my water bottle. Yeah, I don't know why, <laughs> but I'm just gonna use this as an opportunity to fill my water bottle. I'll be right back. All right. Well, shit. That's wacky. Well, how is everyone? Do you enjoy Guilty Gear more than Tekken? I'm so mixed. It's it's so frustrating. I mean, I know that I'm playing against a friend where we are equally both on floor four. But having this like back and forth and i'm like able to put out moves with intention no combos you're not seeing any combos we're basically fighting with specials and normal attacks right but that's also how it was for tekken and then like just watching how different both of the games are you know having a, a mental plan it's just so much so many more moves 
So it's so amusing on how much more fluid I feel like I can navigate a character in Guilty Gear in comparison, but it's... Don't know. Am I really calling it fluid when the only one I've managed to actually do combos in is Tekken? Now, granted, that's because Tekken has combo challenges, but hey. This game does too. They're just from other players. But some of these other players are fucking... They're lab rats, you know? Let's see. Recommended for me. Let's try... Fail to retrieve. Search. Player character. Uh, Elfil. Enemy character doesn't matter. I really don't know what the difference is between combo and set play. I'll just search. Uh, can I sort? Change order. Most... Mm, do I do most clear rate? No, because that's not... They don't care about anything else, like plays or anything. So most likes, combo, mid screen, 50% gauge, far S start, and wild assault. Ooh. But has a 12% clear rate. Now, why is that? Most downloads. For beginners. Oh, hey. Let's try this. I saw... Uh, and it's against Kai. Oh, my God. He's going to learn how to play against Mail now. Mm -hmm. um, I, I was on the Reddit earlier, and someone was like, what am I doing wrong with this combo? And it was a uh, one for soul. It was like put for like for beginners and like a bunch of people in the comments like that is not a beginner combo it is not a bread and butter it's such a niche combo whoever put it for <laughs> beginners is an asshole because it's like <laughs> super technical and then also you're doing this wrong I don't have a play button save Oh, like... There we go. I guess I can just do it from the menu. Oh, cool. So that's like that. for that beginners. Hurt. And uh, I... Done nothing close to that. Now, the problem I have is that close S, I've been very bad at hitting. So it hits twice. Wait, how did that fail? You slid, and I don't think it's a slide. Is, is crouching heavy slash a slide? Ain't it? Do, do back crouch. Like, do, um, do one. Because you're supposed to hit twice, right? That's yeah, why it says SS. It's, yeah, it's close hit. Yeah, close S into standard S and crouching heavy slam into down. Heavy. I just understood how it's labeling it. Oh. It's telling me do close S. When S hits. And then what is S? I'm reading that as press S twice, then press crouching heavy, and then heavy again. Oh, so it's really it's close not. S, heavy slash. Okay, that's really Yeah, so and I, I realized that when I got to here I go, and it just says it once. Because it's a V, I get it's, it. It's fine, I just didn't understand it till now. Okay, so it's just S and then down. That's, that's why. Mm -hmm. Wait, this is all just S? This is all just slash and heavy slash. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. 
Ooh. Why didn't that work? What else Did would you want? Because it doesn't want you to. Oh, I think it, you need to let here I go completely end and then go into another ass. Okay. So, so like here I go is like the flip, but I think you need to let your feet hit the ground so it doesn't like restart it. Well. <laughs> Let's see. I don't know why I looked as if I was going to fucking understand anything I just saw. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the in-game community combat thing is really going to learn what your characters are capable of. It's up to you how to put together what you learn, for sure. That was one of the nicest things when I was, like, trying to do the Bridget stuff. Just being able to see, like, oh, this works with this. Even if I can't take it into a full combo anything I can piece from it. No, what were you saying, sorry? Oh, I'm putting up a room. Good, cause... Brain hurting. I just... I don't know, I just wanna know why... Why it doesn't work. <laughs> All right, well, then what would it have wanted after that? Forward heavy. Okay, so I was right in that here I go can come after forward heavy. Oh, and then that's a far S at that point. Yeah, because nailed it will push you back. Nice. Okay. And then I assume that's to break the wall at that point. Well. Yeah, the, the far S will break the wall. Network. If it works. Wait, what do you mean I'm not connected to the internet? I just fucking downloaded a combo online. So is your online? Let me just reopen the fucking game. This shit is wild tonight. Bad game. I should buy Top Gun. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean. <laughs> it's just it's seventy dollars, and it's really hard to sell it to people when they don't know if they're gonna like it. Yeah, that's my like one thing to like why I won't like take the dive. If it was on like a good sale, I would do it. But by the time it's on a good sale, like I, I will never know how to play the game compared to other people. Well, I mean, that is the thing, right, with fighting games is the best time to get in them is when they come out. I guess they're saying that, like, I'm getting guilty you're late, but, like, it's still a thriving game. I mean, the only thing that really helps with these uh, games and these situations is that, like, ranked kind of solves that issue anyways, because you're going to be fighting against people that are your level and maybe your level is more stacked up with knowledge but like if somebody is at the point that they've been actively playing since guilty gears come out and they're at floor four like we are and i am having not played ranked and i have 60 hours in the game just playing with friends and casuals and you're telling me somebody with like 2,000 hours is at floor four? They ain't my fucking problem. Yeah. Like, I mean, if you're that far still and you've put in the time, it's like, okay, well, doing what? Like, I'm there because I haven't touched this game before. <laughs> but yeah, like... I'm sitting there with 20 <laughs> hours in the game. Like, <laughs> yeah, like a lot of my stuff was like playing offline, like getting achievements, like. 
I got all the achievements for Tekken in the first 20 hours playing the game, and it was all offline, except for playing Tekken Ball because you had to play it online, and that was an achievement. And I was just doing the smashes, and then also was playing a certain type of match in the Tekken Arcade online, and you have to win. That was it. I face off against somebody, I beat them, and then I let them win the next match because uh, you could tell that nobody would have been there if it wasn't for the achievement. Mm -hmm. So it was like, hey, dap you up. I got my win off you. Let me give you your win for you. We'll do a best of three for fun, and then I'll walk the fuck away. seeing this communicating with server pop up seven times it's happened to me before Network. all right player match i think the only thing that kind of depends for you like talking about the conversation of Tekken is a game like this, the characters, at least to me, feel drastically different. Mm -hmm. You know, you have a lot of the special moves, you have a lot of like what they can do. Whereas when you kind of play like Tekken, going from character to character, what I see on the screen is what changes but nothing has really felt like it plays differently. Yeah, you understand. And I mean, that might be due to inexperience, but if anything, that just speaks on the fact that I can touch an anime fighter and, you know, throw out five specials and, hey, my Axel Low compared to my Elf Elf feel entirely different. My Fang to my Reyna, I don't know, one has oh. a shoulder tackle? Uh -oh. I, think, I think Jesse here is broken. <laughs> no answer from host. <laughs> I'm host. Literally just gave me another or your host. I don't know what the hell's going on, but no, I this think it's is a sign. Yeah, it's weird. It's totally not me like unplugging because you're playing Axel or anything. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been a better answer. All right, time for you to climb ladder. I'll do one online. Let's see if it communicates with the server. All right, just jump right to floor 10. I believe in you. Yeah, the fact that you can change everything is wild. With me bouncing between four and five, I've been like, if I get demoted to four, I just go into five because it's like, okay, like, I'm just on a losing streak. It's not my skill. It's just is what it is. What do we got? I wish you could just queue up. There kind of is a way to do that. Um, oh, there I is. I don't know. I don't know if it gives you ranking. She. Um, so you could just go standby in training mode and it does that. Or you can just do quick match which will put you in, like, a training mode thing. Oh, quick start? Yeah. Oh. Only friends I have that play this game is a floor 10 Potemkin player and a floor 10 Faust. I'm lucky to get one win out of 20 matches. I feel that. I mean, I'm sure you were present when Wamey was playing, and, you know, he's floor 6 now, but has reached 10 prior and was a chip. <laughs> like plays the game a lot when an opponent is found start uh any completed matches i guess entry character cool yeah even with tekken i have um uh... no oh no I have that personal experience because uh, the friend that is primarily responsible for getting me interested in Tekken to begin with 
who I only really played with friends when I had seven. So I only had like 60 hours in the game. I got it like towards the end of its lifespan and literally only played with friends. They are marginally better than anyone I've fought online. So I can only take a guess at what their actual rank would have been. Which is a shame because I don't have it as a comparison because they haven't touched rank. Uh, in eight since starting. Let's see. So you kind of knock him away when you do the gun butt bounce. Yeah. It's good if you have him near the wall and you can bounce him off the wall and maybe do something with that. Yeah. You need to like really bounce him, so I guess I need to be low. I was going to try and see if the Rekka went into it and then uh, a Jacko. If they actually, the yeah, if they actually know how to play Jacko, I could be screwed. Okay. Oh, all right. It was taking a second. I was starting to think it was me. That's weird. I'm just kind of waiting to see how they play. I think they were waiting for me to do that. I don't like that they immediately feel better than what I would have expected. I'm just kind of apprehensive. Six rollback frames in that lag. Yeah, it seems like they have a pretty weak connection. 120 MS. I don't even take the tower too seriously. It's just a fun way to get matchup knowledge before I attempt to go to locals. And you know, that is probably a way that I would love to enjoy the game more. I actually would not mind like going to locations, but I guess it's just because I haven't put any effort to see if there's anything around that I, I shouldn't really speak as if there's not. I mean, and I'm in a relatively populated area. I can only imagine. I just don't look. Which maybe I should try. I've played enough fighting games. I wouldn't mind. There we go. I just need trade. Holy shit! That's a read. Oh. Okay. She comes in on me. What's the best move? Nice. Actually playing a Jacko way better than I would have thought. Ooh, that's my death. I thought I was doing the low. Oh, but I need to do an overhead if they're crouching, huh? Yeah, and you'll, if they're low blocking, you'll just hit them. I am thinking of Tekken. <laughs> <laughs> The best part about fighting games is community. It's worth the attempt. I do agree. I think one of the things that I I like about myself to the point that I've gotten to appreciate is that I don't get upset at 
losing too much. And that's partly due to probably the expectation that I will lose a lot, but there's just too many people I'll, I'll be around, whether it's a fucking fighting game like Tekken or League of Legends and they lose and they're pissed and you're like, dude, calm down. Honestly. She's got me on that crouching. I really want to try against it again, but the lag is really hard. Yeah, unfortunately she has like shit connection for you. Or you would like Oop. Yep, you're right. Connection requirements. <laughs> or is it just... I mean, it could also just be Guilty Gear. We were having issues. Yeah. I, I shouldn't be necessarily blaming the person when I don't have real actionable proof. The fact that it just keeps going up, like now it's up to 200, is like kind of annoying. <laughs> yeah, 400 ping, as uh, Medieval pointed out. Yeah. Oh, fuck. I... Went to get press to grab myself, but maybe I should just do the gun more often. Probably. Probably zoning or maybe the best bet right now. There we go, that's the move. It's the slash. Uh-oh, I think she got me. Yeah, that counts, okay. Really, I'm not dead? Oh, well. <laughs> cool. You just touched the wall. Yeah. <laughs> like, I get it, Super should break the wall, but that felt undeserved. Oh, we can rematch again, again? Oh, it did give you a rating update, so I guess it does give you a uh, rating. Yeah, I probably uh, deranked. <laughs> oh, probably. Welcome to Floor 3, baby. That's actually where I learned a lot, though, was Floor 3. Like, to, like the basics and how like, kind of start reading people. Leverless gamer now? Yeah. Now, if only uh, Guilty Ear could be a router gamer now. I, mean, I don't have any idea how to play against a Jacko, really. I think if she has her puppet set, you have to hit her kind of like um, Bridget with her yo-yo. Oh, I didn't think that was the case. Wow. Yeah, it's it's an experience. I'll probably quit out after, but we'll we'll see. The only issue is uh, Swift and I were trying to be playing, um, but Guilty you just kept having issues. Oh, I didn't hold up to do a follow. And yeah, she did. The I, the worst part is when you just assume it won't hit, mm -hmm. like throwing it out because you know it's the best option, and then I just didn't do anything actionable with it. That's because I was crouch blocking, right? Yeah. Okay. As long as I understand. Oh, I tried to grab. That goes through grab, or was I in stun lock? I think it came out before because hers comes out really fast. Like, dust can be quick after their um, wind up, right? Okay. Okay, the maximum. Cool. There we go. D rank, baby. Welcome to floor three. But that's good to know. I didn't know I could just actually go in there. I'd rather do that than, like, sit in, like, lobbies sometimes. Yeah, like, I don't necessarily care who I play against. Mm hmm. I just want to be able to, like, queue up and not care. God, I'm still upset about not being able to figure out what the combo necessarily wanted from me. 
almost all of what she does is negative on block and very negative on whiff, especially without her minions, bait and punish. Okay. I wonder what my go-to punishes are. Probably far slash. I mean, heavy is always good too, but. I think heavy will be too slow to like start uh, a string. I think you gotta go with like a kick or a jab to like get priority. Yeah, probably like 2k. Mm -hmm. 2k, I feel like, just doesn't have good reach. And I could be wrong, but. I don't know. A lot of people play 2k. Yeah, you think so? Probably. Have fun. Time for him to just 6p his way towards you. Ooh, good to know. Oh, I tried to go for a grab. I don't think you can empty grab. Counter, I'd hate if Tekken said that shit. I'm a little biased. It was probably the easiest thing getting into this game was getting a confirmation on if my moves hit or not. Because you have to have like combos on if you get a counter hit because it's different. So I'm a little biased. Oh shit. Shouldn't have gone for that. Gotcha. Woo! Nice. Love playing on the uh the leverless way more for sure. just trying to learn how they're moving and then what I should be doing against it. Tried to flip over again, but I think it's because I was already in motion. Yeah, you can. was apprehensive about like using a special but i was sitting on tension so i probably should have been more open to faultless god damn oh you can't stuff throws when you get up I thought you could. I'd just be Street Fighter. So you can get up, throw, and... Might have been my problem. <laughs> Tekken should have Heiachi's spirit shout at you from beyond the grave if you get a counter hit. Yeah, <laughs> no kidding. Dude, Reyna is such a great character. They, like, absolutely did amazing with it. Didn't stand up fast enough. God, so rough. It's a good fight, though. It didn't even bounce back. Yeah, because he hit you. Yeah. 
Uh, trying to figure out how to handle the vortex, but I don't really know. Do I just kick jab? No, that didn't win right there. Nope, and down doesn't work either. Oh, there's the 5P. Or, um, the ass. Oh, rough. You want to try one more time with me and you? No, nah, my food's almost here, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately. All right. I'm hungry. So I'm going to hop off. Have a yeah. good rest of your stream. It was fun playing. I'm doing another best of three. I'm probably out myself. You take care. Oh, Thanks yeah, for buddy. joining. Take care, y'all. See you tomorrow. Yep. All right. Oh man, how would I have beat the soul? Can I see your Korean backdash? It's a little different in this game now. In Tekken 8. You gotta like, you gotta learn it, I think. Cause you have to hold what, like the, the down more than the back? Ram lethal, you can throw your swords. What should I be aware of? If you're going to jump a lot, I should probably be more ready to do 6P. That was a 6P and it didn't work. Ooh, okay. Yeah, you whiff punish like a motherfucker. I don't know about the button pressing. I saw... I've played against one Bram Lethal. And it was like story mode. I don't think I've ever actually... Oh my god, the damage is insane. Okay, another explosion. More explosion. <laughs> Whenever you see Strive gameplay, it just reminds you of Giovanni. It makes you want to play so bad. Hey, if you want somebody to play against, the way me was playing earlier, you check earlier in the stream when we uh, put a marker on and we changed over. The way me's chip is insane. You want someone to play against a chip Giovanna? I'd love to watch that. Here we go. Hell yeah, getting deranked more. This is what I'm saying where I was like, I absolutely don't should not be a floor floor player. Okay. Soon to be a floor one. <laughs> she I might be. Oh, fuck. I thought that was uh, close enough for the grab. Are you blocking? Yeah, I didn't think so. That didn't work. My finger is held down on my faultless macro. It did nothing. Full 6P. Oh, I did not stuff that well enough, but at least I did on the grab. Hmm, that didn't come back around. 
Not in the way I wanted. Gun not far enough. Okay. Okay. Hmm. We got one. See, I can't really shoot the gun too often because you can also throw your swords. Oh my god, I fucking fell for that. I didn't want to throw out a hit, but I... Do another baby. Oh, that's spicy. I need to get used to uh, doing down heavy into here I go. Did they press the button? I believe so. Cool. Oh no. Okay. I didn't think I'd get that, but that worked. Mm. Getting too cocky and going in there immediately. Hey, why is my faultless button not working? Half tension. I had it happen for a second. I just didn't use burst, right? No. There we Oh, because you have to block. You can't just press the button. Maybe I need to change what macro that's on. Or available button on my controller. All right, I was focusing way too much on that. Yep. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Be overwhelming. Just be overwhelming to the point I can't let them breathe. If I can't breathe, they can't breathe. Maximum number of matches. <laughs> now I'm on floor two. See, now I want to find another one because I'm on floor two. So now I think we'll field out. Okay, immediately. Bridget. We're both the same level, 36. Mankind. Dual one. Let's rock. Mm, burst immediately.
Now this feels like a drastic difference. Nah, I didn't not time 6p well enough. use it for 6p practice but at this point I should just finish it to make sure I don't die Ooh. it's interesting didn't know about that interaction I'll have to be worried about the yo-yo yeah -yeah if I hit you the people in ranks. Why do I, what, why is that a floor two? Are you just mashing? Should I be surprised that you did a half circle and then starship, which is a Z? Like that's, I mean, I started fighting games recently. Those, those were difficult as fucking hell, I guess. If you're not pressing buttons with intention, might be, but like, I don't know. I'm not good enough to be able to tell, you know what I mean? I want to combo that with that, or at least the Rekka, I don't know. They're just not blocking, that's why they're there. Yeah, and then I don't. You know, just started basically playing Elfelt today. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah, because it is a lot of counters, huh? Blocking is a good assessment. That's fair. I should have absolutely backed up and realized that. Now you want to block. What? Oh, mistimed it. Well, I was going to see if that canceled into my special, but it killed, so. Yeah, let's go. Rematch. Oh, right, because they're all confirmed. Got to remember that. I mean, I did play Bridget. I'm trying to see if I could time the start of the Rekka. Yeah, I could do something too. Okay, hold on. Another Rock the Baby.
<laughs> I was trying to do the dust. Uh, should have stuffed 6P, knowing that I would have landed on the ground first. See, I did 6P there, but I was gone. Biggest difference from floors one to four to floor five is where they get gate kept from lack of defense. Uh, yeah, I think that's probably a fair assessment. I've definitely seen that to be the case in my experience with Tekken, because I'm yellow rank as a Steve, which is, I don't know, they go like three ranks, like three, three of the same color, and then it goes to a different color. I want to say that's probably like equivalent to silver in most games. So not substantial, but it's at the specific rank where I start losing um, LP when I lose. Hurrah! And that is absolutely the case. People just do not block. I'm people. Every time I'm like, I got the whiff punish. I throw it out. Turns out I got whiff punished. I was wrong. I'm happy how much more consistent I can throw out. Uh, of course, look forwards. I'm going to take a hit, a lot of hits, because I just realized I really want to try to see the buffer for Axel, Bomber, Squares will go forward and then jump and then press the button. Can I do that with Elfeld or will it take the input from doing it on the ground first? Oh, that changes everything. The range that I just threw that at? Okay, hold on. Now I have to pay attention to you. Oh, is that an overhead? What the fuck am I getting hit with? Okay. Let me be present. <laughs> so I can see what I'm looking at. Okay, that's a charge, right? So you know how to do charges. What are you running in the air for? Oh, that was burst. That's why. Grab. That went over me, so it counted. That sucks. To be fair, blocking is the hardest thing to learn for new players. You can lap combos pretty easily, but can't really lap blocking strings. You are you are right. I mean, defense is probably one of the most like valid things. What most valuable skill that you can have in like a fighting game. I mean, especially and this is a absolute beginner, like absolute novice opinion, but Coming from all of the recent titles that are good, so not Mortal Kombat, they all value aggression way more. Like, they've introduced so many different abilities that just care more about the aggression that you have. So learning how to, like, block against that is extremely valuable. Block. Okay, don't block. Whatever. I'm not your mom. <laughs> Quit! I <laughs> uh, love playing games, man. We're gonna get back to four. Then I'm gonna go back down to one.
it's just amusing. Like this is pressing buttons, but it works. Huh? Why? Why are we having system errors so much? Is this this game or is it me? I really want to know. There's no way to check my MS. Well, not in game, right? What's R code? What is this? Can I not edit this? Oh, no, I can. It's just here. So, what did I earn? What are they talking about? Play time. Yeah, see, 27 hours. 27 hours is my actual play time. When I say 60 before, you know what I mean? Player match, 33 wins. Online lobby, three wins. Just mostly just play for achievements when I originally got it. Ah, uh, I don't really understand that. All right. Network. No, not player match, I want quick start. Yeah, because I really don't want to play as an Axel if I don't understand Axel against other people. Like, I can play it alone. Or do I still try? We're about to throw. But it's a good one to see it out on, I think. I love the idea that you can lab one different person. <laughs> okay. While you're waiting. Axel, 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 Axel. You have down, spinny. You have up and you pull them forward. I don't know what a good follow up during that. I think I just do back heavy slash. Uh, You can press the same button at the same time. Mantis is with green. Winter, 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 kick. Axles. Super specials, the red one. Heaven or hell. I don't know. I don't remember half my moves. To a dazzling encounter. No more messing around, eh? Axel versus Testament. Duel one. Oh, I guess it is two zoners, huh? That's the move I wanted to press. Okay, so I can't really combo it. So we'll just try it down. I gotta remember you can do that. Just trying to see that I know you want to do a lot of like where I'm placed moves. I mean, just got to keep them out, right? Doesn't have to be anything special. Just need to see how they react. <laughs> oh, almost. Got the mantis strong. You gotta throw that out more because I really want to see what that's like.
Okay, well, I didn't exploit it for your benefit, but... That's all right. Rematch? Okay, okay. I'm very bad at how long I have to hold for. Ooh, I pressed a button. That was a bad idea. I think it's my kick is one of my fastest ones. Yeah. Does this get through? What stopped it? Yellow! <laughs> Thing is, most people end up falling for this, and I could, like, just sit there and spam it, but it's so boring, isn't it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> just, uh, just walk up. What do you want from me? No. Yeah. Let's see if you press the button. You did. Most people don't know it's a two hit. By most people, I mean people that are new like me. <laughs> mm. Maybe I do like playing Axel and Ladder. Is it because of just one match? <laughs> Maybe. I do kick more when that happens. Oh, let's not do that now. I really wanted that wind to do more, and it didn't. I really want to use it because it's a new move, but that should not be the case. Okay, let's go back to normal. Let's do a lot of the normal attacks. Oh shit, that hit. Oh, I tried to kick ahead of time. Let's see. One hit, two hit. low enough health you're going to be concerned about it and you're going to back up all i need you to do is not jump well you jumped mm -hmm. that's such 
such a slow hitting move. Oh, I thought I could do it, but no. What's the way to block against that? I okay, I genuinely don't know. Wait, I genuinely don't know. Oh, it's an overhead, isn't it? Overheads are the most dangerous thing in this game. I have earned a bubble bath today. Playing too much Tekken. I gotta like mix it back. All right, that's tight though. I mean, we opened up with Tekken and then, uh, you know, got to play some Guilty Gear with some friends. I will say it's been nice playing Guilty Gear again. I do uh, enjoy Tekken, but I don't mind playing other games. Especially when we get to hang out with Wayme and Swift, which um, is what we will be doing tomorrow. Because I'll check. Pretty sure we're playing uh, Temtem. I think Swift and I need to continue it because we're almost done with it, which is like a Pokemon uh, knockoff in the nicest way, but it is a way harder game. Whole game's double battles. Uh, probably we'll play like fighting game, Tekken or Guilty Gear, see if they want to hang out again like next Tuesday, but at least Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is when I'm streaming. And then Thursday, uh, we're going to continue playing Lethal Company with a group and then i believe a few people when they're like more free from their work are going to join us probably start as like a group of four get up to like five six which would be cool so i'll be modded but other than that thank you very much for watching offline and online i'm gonna go ahead and i guess let's see Luna's online. All right. I'll send you guys over to Luna. She's playing the Assassin's Creed 3. Isn't 3 the first one where they started having like a lot of spammy combat? I don't know. Enjoy. Have fun. I will see you all next time. Uh, goodbye. <laughs>